Oh, baby, oh, baby. Hello, everybody. Welcome back for yet another live stream. Happy Tuesday to everybody out there in the beautiful flight simulator land. I guess, what are we going to call it, guys? YouTube land? How's everybody doing? Welcome aboard, my friends. Thanks for taking the time today. Come and hang out with me. Fly some planes around. Oh, boy, do we have a doozy for you guys today. Everybody's been asking for it. Lo and behold, the captain will provide. I finally got it working. Did some test flights yesterday on my day off. We are going to fly the Magnite 787 Aviators Edition. Oh boy, hope you guys are ready for it. Should be a lot of fun. Um, I really like what they've done. I'm not going to lie. I mean, um, I could see where people are upset. I understand that. But I also have to kind of side with Magnite on this one. They've put in a lot of work. It's looking good. I'm excited to see what's going to come in the near future. I like a lot of the stuff that they've implemented, so it should be a lot of fun. How is everybody doing? Explain Finland, Professor Kidman, uh, Armin Hajitat, Pili UK, Malik Minot, DNP, Malibu Gamer, Casper, Ryzen King, Henry Fly, Epic Life, Affix Stein. How are you, my friend? Uh, Alan Augusta, how are you, man? Spitfire, RAF100, Gennady, Georgiev, Kenway, Casper, Noel5233, how are you, my friend? Welcome aboard, dude. We got Caribbean Aviation, how are you, man? Ride Dog is in the house, welcome, welcome. We got Anthony Baldo as well, welcome aboard, my friend. Hope you guys are all doing well. We got Niels is here, how are you, Niels? Welcome, my friend, hope you're doing well. Materves, Trevin is here, Marty is here, welcome, Marty. Hope all is well. We got Evan Malbright, John Dubio, Will Davey, Bassam, DVA 511, Sergo Fernandez Jimenez. How are you, my friend? Um, what else we got here? We got Charles Collin, the Flight Sim Boy, Michael Del Bell. How are you, my dude? Welcome, welcome. Lennox Wiener, Richard Wood, Eli Berger, Ziggy290, Abraham Roy. How are you, my friends? Welcome aboard, guys. Hope you guys are all doing well. Welcome to the stream. Um, we are basically where we left off. Uh, last week, when we were in North America, we are at the beautiful island of Jamaica, uh, Montego Bay, to be exact, is the airport that we are at right now. Uh, beautiful, beautiful scenery. We're going to head from Montego Bay. Oh, Mr. Pike's coming in with a two euro donation. Thank you so, so much, Mr. Pike. Very, very much appreciated, man. Thanks so much for supporting the stream. He goes, children already in bed. Happy flying all. Thank you so, so much, Mr. Pike. Very, very much appreciated, sir. It's time to fly some planes, my man. Huge no floaties to you, dude. Thank you so, so much for supporting the channel, man. Very, very much appreciated. Alrighty, guys. So, without further ado... Montego Bay, over to Kingston. Very, very short flight. We're going to hit uh, a very, very high altitude here of 13,000 feet. <laughs> it's going to be our cruise altitude for this initial flight. And then the second flight, obviously the one that uh, I think we're all here and ready for, uh, is going to be in the Magnite 787 Aviators Edition from Kingston, Jamaica to Punta Cana, Dominican Republic, we're going warm today. It's way too cold out there, so we're going to go warm in here, right, guys? So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump inside the cockpit here of the Zebo 737. Uh, it was updated last night once again, so running 3.33 Delta now, guys. Uh, so Alpha Bravo Charlie is done. Delta is out. So uh, if you have the Zebo, make sure that you download Delta. Uh, I didn't really even check the patch notes. The patch notes weren't even up yet, so I don't know what they've changed. I don't know. I mean... I enjoyed flying uh, Charlie, so uh, hopefully they made some little fixes to um, Delta here, and it's ready to go. Uh, so we have our ground services. We already have our uh, GPU connected, so that is good. We'll go back, and we'll go ahead and start our flight leg. Wonderful. Let's go up top here, guys. We'll go and get our battery on. We'll arm our emergency lights. Ground power can go on. you hear the flicker. There we go. We'll get our forward-aft pump on. We'll go ahead and get our panel lights on as well. Window heat can go on left side and right side. We'll go all the way up the top. IRS set. Left side nav. Let's wait till it says align. There we go. And right side nav. We'll wait for it to say align here as well. You running the RG mod? No. No RG mod. You really don't need the RG mod, to be honest with you. Especially with the 4K textures now being shipped natively with the uh, with the Zebo. I don't really think you need it. In my opinion. That's just my opinion, right? Um, no smoking signs going on. Fast and seatbelt over to the auto position as well. Let's make sure here that we have our navigation lights on. Wonderful. All right, sweet. Looking good. First things first, we'll go down to the FMC. We're going to get our main panel brightness up here. We'll get it up there as well. 
Go down here. Panel brightness. Wonderful. All right. Down to the FMC. Uh, we're going to go to init ref. We are sitting on the ground. MKJS. MKJS. We'll throw that into our reference airport. Grab that into there. Perfect. We'll go to route. MKJS. Over to MKJP. Kingston, Jamaica. Perfect. We'll throw that in there. Our flight number today is Air Jamaica. A JM. 2086, had to check on that there for a second. 2086, perfect, looks good. All right, we do have ATC online, so we're going to go ahead and give him a call here, guys. 25.4, let's give him a ring, make sure our IFR clearance is worked out, everything's looking good. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. I can't even remember who we're with right now. Kingston Radar, all right, cool, Kingston Radar. Kingston Radar, good afternoon, Air Jamaica 2086, IFR to Kingston, please. Uh, Jamaica 206 here to, uh, correction, the highest altitude I could give you is 11,000, can you accept? A firm 1, 1,000 works for us for a Jamaica 2086. Jamaica 2086 to Mali, the altitude departure, well, maintain 5,000 squawk 0702. I declared into Kingston via the Elutu 2 departure climb, maintain 500702 in the box, Air Jamaica 2086. Jamaica 2086, if that is correct, push and start, are you on discretion? Call for taxi, QNH 1014. Push and starts on us, we'll let you know we're ready to taxi. Thanks so much, Air Jamaica 2086. Hey, perfect, so we got our clearance, guys. Everything looks good. Let's go down here, we're going to go to departures. Uh, according to the winds here, I mean, what are the winds? Uh, zero four zero at nine. So we're gonna get runway zero seven. So we're gonna do the Elutu two departure, runway zero seven with the Kembo transition. Go to route, activate, and execute. Perfect. And then we all we need to do, guys, we're gonna go right to our arrival airport here. We are planning the Kino two arrival ILS Better runway one afternoon. two. With the Kembo transition. Uh, we're going to take a look here. Let's go MKJ. MKJP, we're going to go to Rival, ILS runway 12, and it looks like we're going to want to take it probably from Fable. So let's get Fable in here, we'll execute that, perfect. Look at that, all that looks wonderful, great. Alright, sweet, so we're looking good there, guys. Uh, we got one 1,000 plugged in, but we're going to put five, because we need 5,000 feet. Alright, sweet. Let's go spend some time on our electronic flight bag over here, we're going to go to our... Thanks very much. Fuel. Uh, On today's flight, we need 4.2. Let's get 4.2 plugged in there. And then we're looking. Hey, Kingston Radar, this is Jermaine 422. Looking to grab out Mark Clarence. Kingston, please. Payload 19.4. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing at him. Nice. <laughs> the controller's <laughs> laughing. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> what a goofball, man. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Alright, let's take a look here. We got Casper coming in with a $1 donation. Thank you so, so much, Casper, for the support, dude. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Just bought the side tech water pedals online. Oh, baby, oh, baby. Hell yes, dude. Very nice, Casper. I actually really love the feel of the SciTech rudder pedals. Right, good choice, man. Very, very good choice. <laughs> this fucking guy, dude. <laughs> all right, let's go down here. Let's go to our net ref page. Let's plug all this in here. Zero fuel eight sixty point eight gross of 65. Reserves, we're going to have two. We're looking for a cost index today of 3.5. Uh, our cruise level is going to be 1.1,000, one, 1, as you heard the controller. Um, let's update our weather here along the way. Approaching. It is showing that average winds are going to be 0, 0.15. Uh, oops, clear that out. 0, 0.15. God damn it. 0, 0.15 at 15. Well, there we go. We'll throw that in there. Ice deviation is plus 13. Welcome to the Caribbean. Uh, perfect. Let's go to our N1 limits here, guys. We'll enter that in. Uh, definitely can do a D-rated takeoff today. 96.6 looks good. We'll go to takeoff with flaps position 5. We'll enter our CG weights here. 24.1 with a trim value of 4.79. 
perfect. V1, 137. VR, 138. V2, 147. And with all that, guys, our pre-flight is complete. <laughs> uh, let's get American sent me a PM. He's like, I did not expect him to laugh. <laughs> let's get 162 plugged in on our speed here. We got another donation coming in. Let me go ahead and check that out here. We got Jonathan Hab coming in with a $10 donation. Thank you so, so much, Jonathan, for the support. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. He goes, got to go to work. Here's one for the best flight simmer ever. Jonathan, thank you so, so much, my friend. Absolutely insane. Huge no floaties to you. Holy moly, we got Bowen Lover coming in with the $50 donation. Bowen Lover, thank you so, so much, my friend. Absolutely wonderful. Huge no floaties to you, man. Thank you so, so much for supporting the stream, man. Very, very much appreciated. He goes, I'm back. Where's Smitty? I don't know, man. Smitty might be coming home for lunch. I know he usually comes home for lunch. Not quite sure. I haven't Approaching. seen him yet. He's probably around, though. James Wire, thanks so much, James, for that subscription as well, dude. Huge Elf Floaties to you, man. Welcome aboard. And Boeing Lover, once again, man, thank you so, so much, dude, for the support. Let's get a huge damn it, Smitty, and a huge no Floaties in chat, guys. For Bowen Lover, very, very much appreciated, Bowen Lover. Thank you so, so much, dude. Let's get our flight director left side, flight director right side. We got 5,000 plugged in. We'll go LNAV, we'll go VNAV. Beautiful. I think we're pretty much good to go here, guys. Let's go ahead and get our seatbelts to the on position and engine mode selector to both. Let's go ahead and fire up our APU. While that's going up, let's go to better pushback. We'll go to start pushback. Please show me where you want to go. That is exactly where we need to go, so we're going to go right there. Perfect. Toe is driving up. Wonderful. Toe is driving up. Looking good. Uh, we're just going to wait for our APU to fire up here before we get the rest of our fuel pumps on. Uh, we got Bowen Lover coming with a $25 donation. Thank you so, so much, Bowen Lover. Again, $75, man. Thank you so, so much, dude, hey, can you for see the support. Radar to make a sport, too, too, looking for pushback clearing on <laughs> for the Just support. The Thank you so, complete. so much, Bowen Lover. Huge no floaties and damn it, Smitty, for you, man. Thank you so, so much, Bowen Lover. Very, very much appreciated, my man. <laughs> Oh, boy. All right, now we'll talk to Dave. Super Jamaica, Sport 2, 2, thanks, sir. <laughs> Dude, he does it so well. Like, how the hell did he get so good at that accent? That's what I want to know. Like, what is going on that he got so okay, good at that accent? And are closed. <laughs> Absolutely insane, me. man. APU gens are going on. APU bleed is on. External power is going off. You'll see the APU bleed start to come alive there. Perfect. Let's go back here, guys. We're going to go to ground services. Disconnect GPU. Wonderful. Let's go up top here. Let's get our beacon light on. She's going to close those doors. We're going to get ready to rock and roll out of here. The tow is picking us up. Yes, it is. Wonderful. Get the jet way to go. It's American. Enough said. Uh, DNP, I use. I'm not quite sure which one it is. It's going to be one of these ones. You still get out because it loses people talking like that all the time. True. True. <laughs> True. Anna. Jesus, Bowen Lover coming in with another $25 donation. You're absolutely insane, man. Up to $100. Thank you so, so much, Bowen Lover. Huge no floaties to you, man. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Huge no floaties and a damaged Smitty. Coming in with $100, Bowen Lover. Thank you so, so much, man. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Absolutely insane. All right, guys, we're going to release our park break. Perfect. I love the accent on the guy, too. All right, so our APU gen is online. APU bleed is on. We got duck pressure. Perfect. Engine number two. Over to the ground position. Uh, we got Fornax coming in with the thousand Chilean pesos. Thank you so, so much, Fornax, for the support. Because John Wayne is back. <laughs> Absolutely awesome. Thank you so, so much, Fornax. Hope you've been doing well, man. Welcome, welcome. Vanch, how are you, dude? Welcome aboard as well, man. Hope you guys are all doing well. Thank you so, so much for that support. Fornax, very, very much appreciated, my friend. Hope you've been doing well. Y'all want to shake and bake? Yeah, of course we want to shake and bake. Come on now. Uh, <laughs> get this man an emote. <laughs> oh boy. We should get a shake and bake emote. We definitely need a shake and bake. I don't know how we're going to do it, but can somebody figure out how to do a shake and bake emote? Either Dan or um, somebody do it. Oh my goodness me. Boy and lover, you are absolutely insane, dude. Coming in with another $50 donation. Jesus, man. Smitty's son reincarnated. 
<laughs> Huge no floaties to Boeing Lover and it damaged Smitty. Thank you so, so much, man. Very, very much appreciated, Boeing Lover. You are absolutely insane. Thank you so, so much, dude. $200 or $150. Absolutely insane, man. Thank you so, so much, my friend. Operation complete. Set park and break. Park break is set. Engine number one over to the ground position here, guys. Let's go, man. Shake and bake. Oh, boy. I absolutely love... Flying with American when he's doing his voices, man. It's <laughs> on a different level, dude. <laughs> what a guy. All right. We are uh, Echo, short of Foxtrot, ready to attack. Ooh, got another crib over there. There we go. Look at him. Oh, baby. Houston radar, Caribbean Airways, uh, 320, ready to attack. Caribbean Airlines, 320. Taxi Alpha holding point runway zero seven. Alpha holding point 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 you are $35 off of Nadia. Thank you so, so much, Bowen Lover. Huge no floaties to you, man. Up to $175 now. Absolutely insane. Thank you so, so much, my friend. Very, very much appreciated, dude. Give way to the United 737. back. All right, guys. We've got two good engines. Let's go ahead and set flaps to position five. Um, auto brake over to max. RTO. Anyway, uh, turn offs on. Taxi light is on. Right here and wait. Uh, we got a problem on the plane. It's no bigger than a minnow and a fishing pound, but uh, my plane's acting. So we need to figure that out. Jesus Christ, dude. This guy is absolutely. <laughs> I got a problem, but it ain't no bigger than a minnow and a fishing pound. Probably that. We'll let you know for Jamaica four two two. What a guy, dude. <laughs> I got a problem, but it ain't bigger than a minnow and a fishing pond. Jesus, man. Bowen Lover, my goodness me, coming in with another $50 donation. You are absolutely insane, my friend. Absolutely insane. That's going to put you up to 225 Thank you so, so much, Bowen Lover, for the support today, man. Absolutely insane. Huge no floaties to you, man. Jesus. You are absolutely nuts, dude. Let me get you in here to the FO of the month. Uh, we're going to put Boeing Lover. Oops, no caps. Gonna put, uh, wait, how do you want it? Should we just put Boeing 7? Yeah, we're just gonna put Boeing 787. That's gonna work better. With the $225. Uh, thank you so, so much, Airlines Boeing lover. Like very, very much appreciated, man. Absolutely amazing. Let me go ahead and throw that in there for you. And we got Tucker R coming in with a $2 donation as well. Thank you so, so much, Tucker, for the support, man. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Absolutely amazing. Thank you guys so, so much for the support today. You guys are absolutely nuts. Absolutely nuts. There we go, man. Uh, it says, how much have I donated all time? Tucker, I would have to check, dude. I have to check somewhere in the analytics. But I could probably check on that for you, man. Thank you guys so, so much for the support. Very, very much appreciated, guys. Absolutely insane. Has been tamed. We are ready to take off. This guy, man. I love how the controller is laughing, too, man. Like the controller can barely keep it in as well. It's so good. Yeah, Roger, they ain't rolling seven to take off. Uh, oh, my four. lord. Two, two, thanks, sir. <laughs> hey, Kingston Radar, Air Chief. Oh. My bad. Go ahead. That was my bad. Oh, shit. We got Bowen Lover coming in with another $25 donation. Thank you so, so much, man. He goes, just to make sure no one catches me. Bowen Lover, huge no floaties to you, dude. Thank you so, so much, man, for the support today. Correct. Absolutely insane, dude. You are absolutely yeah, so nuts. We get 250 in there. Thank you so, so much, man, for the support today, dude. Absolutely amazing. Both Huge no floaties to you, dude. And I think that deserves some damage, Smitty. Because if Smitty was here, I know he'd be spamming some damage, Smitty. Um, he's a piece of entertainment, I reckon. Oh, yes, he is. 
Oh yes, he is. <laughs> Azure Land coming up with a five dollar donation. Thank you so so much, Azure Land. Very very much appreciated, man. This is a great day, my friend. Thanks for the great flight, Cap. Thank you so so much, dude. Very very much appreciated, man. Thank you so so much for the support, Carib Aviation. You've been here forever, dude, and you just spam that word. Come on, man. Like now you're banned, dude. There's nothing I can do. I just witnessed it right in front of me. You're banned for life. Good job, man. That sucks, dude. You've been here for a while too. Oh well. VIP. American Airlines, Air Jamaica. Linux for German, how are you, dude? Welcome aboard, man. Hope you are doing well. Who went rouge? <laughs> Who went rogue? <laughs> Uh, what? How did he get in here again? What? Well. <laughs> well, well, well. Look who we found. We have the Twitter contact at 4,000. Ah, nice. All right. This guy, man. Oh, boy. Ivan the Great. He's back. Kicks the radar, to make a. Oh my goodness! I can't get a fucking. I can't get. A, I can't get a radio call in left, right, or center here, man. I was gonna say it's been oddly quiet so far. Uh, can start the stream. I'm here. PK, uh, what's going on, dude? Welcome aboard, man. All right, now up to one one thing. I'm looking for Jamaica four two two. I gotta tell you, sir, it's bumpy as hell up here. <laughs> this guy. Man. Oh, normal for Jamaica. It kicks the radar. Jamaica twenty eighty six ready to taxi runway seven. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jamaica two zero eight six taxi by Echo Alpha hold runway zero seven. Echo Alpha holds short zero seven air Jamaica twenty eighty six. Thanks, man. His accent is. Uh, I'm having a good chuckle over here. That is amazing. <laughs> yeah, it's really on point, huh? <laughs> Jesus, man. Find my home tab cap. I need butter. Jermaine, how are you, dude? Welcome aboard, man. I'm going to do my yeah. best today for some... <laughs> I'm going to do my best today for some butter, man. Thank you so, so much, Jermaine. Very, very much appreciated. You know, for when I'm ready to go. <laughs> this guy, man. <laughs> then it just goes, yeah! Yeah! Do I like the 787? I do. I do. I think they're doing a great job yeah, on it, man. I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what they do with it. To be honest with you. Hey, listen there, shell truck. I'm gonna revoke your license. Did Jaren talk to you in private? He kind of knows the problem about Ivan. Uh, I mean, unless I miss something this on Discord, center, nope. Uh, three wings, three three eight, just, uh, three zero for, for landing at Cap, your new skin is coming. Nice, Zap, uh, awesome, it. dude. Uh, very, very cool, man. Looking forward to that. Ban the shell up, truck, like, right? Uh, That's what I'm saying, up. man. Ivan. <laughs> like this guy just like doesn't give two. Can we just look at what's going on right here? Three of them. Ivan doesn't give a fuck. He's either stupid or he just doesn't give a fuck. I'm going with stupid. <laughs> like I mean, at this point I gotta go stupid, man. Cause like Ivan, dude. <laughs> like come on, man. No one to cut your losses, buddy. Holy. Best thing to do is capture in class. Nice, exotic. Don't get caught, man. And if you do get caught, tell your teacher you're watching educational flight videos. You'll probably get away with it then, right? Thought wall up just a friend of mine. <laughs> yeah, right? Uh, that's night. Imagine it's been night trolling us, dude. Imagine, like, night disappears and it's just been night the entire time. <laughs> night, night goes rogue, buys the Peter Hager A380 just to troll me. <laughs> Could you fucking imagine, dude? Oh my god. <laughs> um, you thought he's an... Oh, he's definitely an attention seeker. Come on. Yeah, that's uh, without a doubt. 
Uh, I think I'm supposed to have Runway Follows Terrain, and I think I turned it off last night. Uh, I definitely am. I don't think we're supposed to see under the building like that. Let's just not pay attention to that. Wouldn't it, uh, class's geography lesson watching this in class? True! You That's actually not bad. Negative climate maintain 1,000. Negative climate maintain 1,000. 1,000 United 4, 9, 4. Turn radio last 3205, it was 2 departure, runway 0, speed for takeoff, wind 0, 5, 0, at 1, 0, left. Downloading Orbex T okay, takes up all my bandwidth. Take off, uh, right on, uh, That's no good. So we'll send him some box with attention, wrote in caps would say it's the attention you ordered, <laughs> right? Oh man, out of control. My Apple Play won't let me dono anymore. What, really? <laughs> you spent too four, much. Two, two, two. Expect the ILS approach for runway one, two. Proceed direct, you know, descend and maintain nine or something. All right, now down to 9,000 direct, you know, and we will expect the ILS for runway <laughs> one, two, for... Jamaica 426, thanks, sir. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. This guy gets me every time. VIP 338, maintain 5,000. Oh, out of control. And Kicks Radar, Jamaica 2086 is ready to go, runway 7. Jamaica 208, 660, for takeoff, runway 0758, to departure. Clear for takeoff, fly to departure, okay, air to make uh, 2086. Kepke, have you heard of a geo? <clears throat> what geo? What do you mean geo? Approach. Geography? Yes, the 77 just bought it yesterday. Nice, Kevin. How are you enjoying it, man? Pauses, blasts out the call sign suddenly. <laughs> right? <laughs> air to make a 422. He forgot his call sign. He had to think about it for a second. <laughs> Do you know when the road MD11 will be out as well as the uh, yeah, Felix? I wish I knew that, man. I wish I knew that, dude. Unfortunately not. I don't know when they will be out. All right, guys, throttles up to about 40%. Right, for the ILS, so I'll, uh, I'll grab that. Looks good. Toga. Take off power set. Airspeed is alive. Caribbean Airlines. Cross track. My Caribbean Airlines 320 radar contact passed into 2900. Come and maintain one way. Oh, 4000 Caribbean 320. Rotate. Positive brake. Gears going up. How right now, down, five down. Where I go? Hold that pitch right there for climb. 400. Follow our flight director is going to make a slight left turn here through almost through a thousand feet. 1,000. There we go. 1,000. Tilt that nose down, start gaining some speed. Beautiful coastal picture right there for you guys. Oh, baby. Looks beauty. There's good, gaining some speed through 190 knots. Let's go flaps up position one. Perfect runway turn off, lights are coming off, taxi lights coming off, logo lights coming off, wing lights coming off here as well. What a nice departure, guys. Let's go flaps up position and clean through 210 knots here, guys. Tilt that nose down just a tad. Gain some speed out of here. Using a joystick? Yes, I am. She's bumpy up here. Hey, hey, here we are. Jamaica 4, do I got to say it, sir? 
still really bumpy at about 8,000 feet. And we're going faster than Autopilot's going right on. Now, so, uh, How did he get up here? We're trying to slow down, but if we continue going at that fast, they come yeah, in dude, faster. He's getting in. good at like this whole little slew and stuff. He's already banned. Uh, no problem. <laughs> Let me know. Look at that, man. Look at that picture right there, guys. That Jamaican coast. Oh, baby. Roger that for uh, Jamaica 422. Uh, Jamaica 2086 for the car attack passing through 4,500. Come in with the 1,000. 1,000 here, Jamaica 2086. Thanks. Poet Lover coming in with another $25 donation. You are absolutely insane, man. He goes, I think I fixed it. Hell yes, you did, dude. Huge no floaties to you, man. Thank you so, so much for the support, dude. Absolutely awesome. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Jamaica 422, you are 7 miles from Kino, clear island, turn right 1, 2, descend and maintain 4,000 until established. Jamaica 422, you are 7 miles from Kino, clear island, turn right 1, 2, descend and maintain 4,000 until established. You mean GOFS is on fight similar? Yes, I have heard about that. I have seen that. Okay, line. One outside, press number 2 or 3 will make it stable even when it's bumpy. Yes. Yes. 290 for Kirk and 320. Is this the first flight? Yes, it is indeed, my friend. Down to 240 knots for Caribbean 320. 1,000 to go. 1,000 feet to go. Or should we go to 1,000, not 10,000, Cap? Okay, we got 2086 for this. 240 knots. 240 knots. Air Jamaica 2086. No Ivan today? Oh, he's been everywhere, dude. Just, we're, we're prepared today. Look at the reds. We're prepared today. There's one 1,000. We're going to keep our speed up here, guys. Look at that. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Azonique, how are you, man? Welcome aboard, dude. Using default water or a texture mod? It is a texture mod, my friend. For your safety, it's important to... How long will this flight take? Six Not six long at all, man. Not long at all. We will be, uh... Please be descending here after. shortly. I'm gonna leave the seatbelts on, because we're only going up to 1-1,000. One, one uh, what do you think about Please B3D? Where to 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 each their own, man. Devices. I think it's a dated platform that's being kept alive Please by add-ons. That that's pretty much it. Free rate, Nick, out of control. After the this is Active Sky, we'd be getting 20 weekend. FPS. Michael yeah, Salem! Thanks so much, Michael, for the support, too. Very, very much appreciated, man. Glad you're enjoying the content. Very, very much Today is a month since you sponsored. Nice, but turns. Thanks so much, man. Side tech, I want to buy the oak, but it's sold out everywhere. I don't know if they're making it anymore, man. I mean, Logitech bought SciTech, so I mean, they probably should be making it. I'm just not sure where to pick it up now. Uh, give me a second, guys. Here, just getting the charts ready. We're going to do the ILS runway 1-2, so we need to get 109.1 plugged in. 109.1. knots for Air Jamaica 2086. 180. Uh-oh. It's like we're flying a Cessna right now, boys. Uh, all right, 120. 120 on the front course looks good. How right now, Cleveland, uh, runway 12 for Jamaica 4226. So out of control, man. <laughs> I love it. Oh, boy. 787 is $300? Nope, not even close. It's like $40 for it. Is this X Atmo? Okay, really, you guys are such trolls, man. <laughs> 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 Guys are out of control, 
out of control. Rikino, I recommend the RNAV 1 uh, 2 if ILS is a offset. Uh, maybe Oscar will see. He looks like he's giving everybody the ILS, so we'll probably just take the ILS. I gotta go, Cap, but I'll probably see you more if I have the Dominican Republic. Hopefully, Ivan isn't too much of a bother. Thanks so much, T Storms. Much appreciated, man. Do I only perform live streams? Yes, Ruben. As of now, I only do live streams four days a week, man. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday, my friend. Um, I'm using Rex, right? Jesus. You guys are so savage, man. Savage. I feel like we probably have to have Flaps 1 out here. Because of this, such a slow speed. Do we need to? Nah, we probably don't even. Let's just not do anything. The plane will probably fly at 180. It's probably got like a stupid... Attitude nose up right now. Is this the Zebo? Yes, sir, it is. The Zebo 737. This is why you get the yolk. Uh, I mean, we'll be getting it soon. We're getting the honeycomb yolk. Why are there no passengers on board? We are the three three eight. Your casino, your credit island, for runway one to the descent and maintain. What did you say? Establish, maintain one eight zero not one two five. Hello, passengers. How's everybody doing? Wonderful. Hope you guys are all doing well. Clear the ILS. Thanks so much for flying with us today here in Jamaica. Despite have bags of milk? Uh, Absolutely, man. So cumulus clouds? Yes. How much is the honeycomb yolk? 229 for the yolk, 200 for the throttles. Confirm one six zero. Not for United. Is there snow where I am? Absolutely, Professor. Yep. We got yeah, a cabin tour without even asking one, right? That's what kind of captain I am for you guys, man. Forgot to close the door. Though. Can you see a radar to make four two two? We clear for island one two correct, sir. Uh, Affirm. <laughs> All right, we will land. Lord willing, the creek don't rise for uh, to make four two two. They turn. <laughs> with the Lord willing. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna land with the Lord willing, runway one two. <laughs> what a guy, man. Traffic. Oh traffic, boy. Traffic. Traffic. Ivan. <laughs> Lord willing. Come <laughs> get. Where's the bag milk cat? <laughs> Fuck. I know, booby. I don't even drink milk anymore, yeah, man. Like I literally yeah, need to buy bagged milk yeah, just for you guys. I promise I will buy it. I promise. I will buy it. Some bagged milk. One day I'm just going to start the stream. Instead of me, it's just going to be me holding a big bag of milk. <laughs> He's invisible? No, he probably got banned the second he got online. Watching this makes me want to go home and do a flight. Absolutely exotic. Absolutely, man. My job's working. Looks like the troll is back. Oh, he's always back, man. Uh, 2086, uh, okay, expect the Isla Spurs runway 1 to descend and maintain 1,000, clear direct, you know. I do expect the ILS runway 1, 2, and can I get the altitude and direct to, I think you said Kino, uh, for Air Jamaica 2086? Jesus Christ. Smitty! Okay, from direct Kino, descend and maintain 5,000. Kino 5000, Air Jamaica 2086, thanks so much. Alrighty, Smitty! Uh, can you see radar, Jamaica 422, think we're about to overrun the runway. <laughs> yeah, you're going pretty fast there. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're going we're pretty fast. For, uh, Jamaica 422, we're in the water. <laughs> <laughs> we're in the water. Cameron! What did you do? Cameron's in the water. <laughs> Oh my lord. Smitty coming in with the hundred and dollar uh, donation. Uh, Huge no floaties and damn it, Smitty to the man, the myth, the legend. How are you, Smitty? What is going on, man? Thank you so so much, Smitty, for the support. There he is. The Smitty is here. What am I getting a fucking warning for? Oh, oh, not good. Uh, Smitty up to seven hundred dollars this month. Thank you so so much, Smitty, for the support, man. Very very much appreciated. And we got Andrew P. We're taking off out of the water. I'm gonna disconnect. What am I getting a fucking warning for here? This is no bueno. 
I don't know what we're getting the warning for. Uh, Andrew P, thank you so much, dude. He goes, here's the money for milk bags. Enjoy. <laughs> Andrew, thank you so, so much, man. Huge no floaties to you, dude. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Absolutely wonderful. Uh, trim? Speed is our discretion for Jamaica 2086. Thanks. Air condo? Getting an air conditioning fail. Recirc fans are on, trim air is on, packs are auto, isolation valve is auto, APU bleed is off. Off scheduled descent. Ah, because we only did one 1,000. Got it. All right. We're good. Don't worry. I got you guys. We good. We good. It's because I put one 3,000 instead of one one, our initial. We're good. We good. We good. All righty. So we got Kino here. We're approaching Kino. It's supposed to be a Kino for 5,000. Back on our glide path here. So my birthday tomorrow. I feel like aging faster. You are five miles from Kino, descend and maintain four thousand until established cleared ILS North Runway one two. Four thousand until established cleared ILS runway one two here, Jamaica twenty eighty six. Um uh, VIP runway one two wins one four zero seven. Well happy birthday, X Bay in Finland. We won't be around tomorrow, so happy birthday to you now, my friend. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with us, dude. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. All right, there we go. Spoilers armed. Let's bring our speed down here about 220. I'm going to go localizer. Thousand to go. Thousand to go. Type of clouds are those X and Viro. 1.07S, my friend. So birthday one week from today. Nice face. We'll be streaming one week from today, man. We'll have to tune in. Hopefully we'll catch it. Yeah, it's bumpy as all hell here today, isn't it, guys? Coming in hot. Is there any reading material I need to go through before starting X.11 except the FSX Real World Training Book, FAA Manuals, and the VATSIM Theory? I think that's pretty much it, Vance. You should be good at, with everything else, man. Everything else, you can probably find tutorials up online. So many great tutorials nowadays, thanks to, you know... The likes of YouTube, Twitch, and all that fun stuff. So, there are so, so, so many. It's weird. It's showing us, like, dead on. Is that what you were saying for the ILS? It's off? Approaching. A fitting end, right? American ends up in the soup? Like, what? <clears throat> Alrighty guys, let's go flaps position 5. We'll hit our approach switch here. We're gonna get 190 plugged in as we're about to hit our glide slope here Do the space shuttle landing in the future? <laughs> Maybe. That's just how Kingston is. Really? That's weird, man. There is an offset to the runway. Alright, Lincoln's got it. Sweet. That's interesting. I had no clue Why is it like that? Is it like that for a reason? Let's go uh, speed 170. We're on the glide slope now guys uh, We can drop our uh, gear We'll go flaps position 10. Go down to the FMC here. We'll go to init ref. We're looking for a flaps 40. <clears throat> Speed is about 140. Should be good there. I'm going to maintain about uh, 170 knots. Let's clean up the wrestling some pigs in the dirty mud hole. Can't make the second flight, I gotta go to the bank in the store. Uh oh. Turps manual only allows for offset back for train obstacle clearance. Gotcha. That makes sense. Wonder if it's like that hill right here? It's odd. 
Alright guys, let's get our final approach speed plugged in here, looking for 140. You guys can all get your landing rates in now as well. If you have not done so already, make sure you get your landing rates in. Got our auto brake set here, position 2. Let's go flaps 15, guys. Actually, you know what? We're going to drop flaps 25 now. Can wait till we get under these clouds before I take control of the aircraft. We're going to fly the 787 after this flight. Yes. We are, we are. Let's go flaps 30 and flaps full. 140 is plugged in. We have a visualization of the airport. We're gonna let everything get stabled here. Let the engines do their thing. All right, cool. My airplane, my throttles. Ivan, you're not gonna get away with it anymore, dude. Like, that's it, Ivan. It's done, man. You're done, dude. Fucking Ivan, man. You're so stupid, dude. Like, Ivan, you're not winning anymore, buddy. That's it, man. We've caught on to you. We know what you're doing. You're finished, Ivan. That's it, man. Time to move on, buddy. Find someone new to go fucking bother, man. That's it. Your time up. Your time's up. We got Bartuz coming in with a three pound, four pound donation. Have a good landing. Thanks so much, Bartuz. Crystal Emily 12 wins 140 at 7 knots. 112, cleared to land. Air Jamaica 2086. It says, Have a good landing, waiting for the 787. Bartuz, thanks so much, man. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Thanks for supporting the street. That was not Ivan? Are we sure? Because it was somebody who spawned in right under me. I'm pretty sure it was Ivan. He's trying, man. 1,000. 1,000. Speed stabilized, Mr. Birch Allen, as you said. Right in the middle of the runway. Light he already got slow. taken off, though. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. Explain. Can we fle please Light fix slow. the Pappy system? Light slow. Light slow. Light slow. He literally just logs in and Light starts slow. spamming, Light like slow. spamming Light messages. <laughs> so stupid, dude. <laughs> Brandon Bass, thanks so much, dude. Good luck on the landing. Much appreciated, my friend. <laughs> oh, boy. Two. Ivan. Ivan, Ivan, Ivan. What a class act, man. 100. 50. 40. 30. 20. 10. Hope of those reversers, hold that nose. Throw the D-cell nose down gently. Eighty knots. Eighty knots, throw those reversers. Over to manual braking. Auto brake to the off position. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Kingston, Jamaica. American, how the hell did you run off the runway? <laughs> There's so much room here. Ramp on Alpha. Thanks for the wonderful ATC man. We'll catch you soon, hopefully, for our second flight uh, for Air Jamaica 2086. Alrighty, my friends. We made it. Oh, baby. Let's go and get our landing lights off. We don't even need any of our lights, to be honest with you. We'll just fire up that APU. Make sure that our strobe lights are off here as well. Tasty bread. I got the butter for you guys. 
We're back to buttering. Back to buttering it out. We all know that guy's my voice not to give him any attention. Yes. There you go. Dot wallop knows. They're watching, guys. Do not worry. Do not worry. The dot wallop crew is here, my man. That is a really cool gate. I think that's like one of the neat. Like, look at that. It's just like off on the side. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, train rider can go off. Uh, All of our lights look good. Let's go ahead and get ourselves into gate number four here. Beautiful airport scenery, guys. Beautiful scenery. Did you float a little long? Yeah, it was a little bit floaty, yep, yeah, without a doubt. Uh, Brandon Best coming in. We have a butter. Good job. Thanks so much, Brandon. Much appreciated, my friend. Glad you're enjoying the content, dude. Welcome, welcome. With the way our landings have been going lately, we're taking floats, guys. I don't give a fuck. All right. APU Gen is going online. Let's go ahead and disconnect from Squawk Box. Wonderful. Uh, APU Gen is online. Engines over to auto. Cut our fuel. One and two. If you bleed is on, engine bleed is off. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the entire flight crew, we'd like to welcome you to Kingston, Jamaica. Oh, baby. We made it, my friends. Look at that. Beautiful Caribbean Airlines Air Jamaica. Oh, yes. Uh, we got soups watching? Yes, at all times right now. <laughs> yeah, man. It's gotten to that point. Ivan Ivanov. Special, special person. All right, guys, let's toggle replay mode. Let's back that sucker up. Let's take a look at that landing. I think we was a little bit floaty. Not too bad, though. Could have came in a little bit steeper. I think my, again, with the whole new flight model, what's going on is I'm, I'm flaring as if we were prior to 11.30. Um, I think a lot of you will attest that you barely need to flare the planes right now. It's, uh... I don't know if it's the new ground model, if it's something to do with the Zebo. And watch, you'll see it. Like, I flare way too heavily. There you go, see? Um, it, it happens almost every time. Thankfully, we're able to still get that collectively. But, um, yeah, it's that it's that new flight model with 11.30. It seems to really, really get me. 1 out of 10, what would everybody rate the 77 Aviators Edition? As of right now, it states about a 6 or a 7. Uh, with what they have going on, I would fully suggest that it being a, um, uh, hi from Ireland, you know we are all watching to see if you crash. Wh what, really? Well, I mean, you're gonna have to go find somebody else, man. Go watch Chili Willies or something like that. We don't crash a lot here, man. Uh, you missed a dono by Boeing Lover? Oh, shit, I did, man. Hold on, let me check that. Let me check that. I was trying to set up all these views here for you. We don't even have music playing, man. Hold on. Let's get the music jamming here. You can see, like, we're just over-flaring it just a tad. Um, not bad, though. We'll take a look at the wing view here as I take a look at those donos. Give me a second here, guys. Three, five hundred. Alrighty, we got uh, S3BB96 coming in with the membership. Thank you so, so much, my friend. Very, very much appreciated. We got Bowen Lover coming in with another $25. He says, here, bring it to 300 please. Thank you so, so much, Bowen Lover, for the support, man. Fairy. Very much appreciated, my friend. Let me bump you up to 300 here. Sorry if the video quality goes to shit here, guys, for a sec. There we go. 40, 30. And the membership, yeah, we got that one too. S3 BBI 96. Thanks so much, man, for the support, dude. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Absolutely wonderful. Definitely floated the hell out of that one. That is okay, though. Like I said, compared to our landings right now, we're taking that all day long, guys. All day long. What throttle setup do I have? I have the Thrustmaster T16000M. That is what it looks like right there, my friend. On these nice little metal tracks. Very nice. Very sturdy. I enjoy it. Damn it, Smitty! Smitty, the man, the myth, the legend. Am I a real pilot? No, sir, I am not. I do this for fun, man. All right, guys. Well, there we go. First flight is in the books. I'm going to go ahead and throw it to the Be Right Back screen. Going to reload into the Magnite 787, and I will see you guys in about 
five minutes. Checking updates. Updates finished. Checking updates. Updates finished. Alrighty, my friends, welcome back inside the simulator. 
Oh, baby, oh, baby. You guys know what time it is, my friends. Oh, yes. What do we have here? The Magnite 787. Oh, boy. Are you guys ready for this one? I don't know if we're ready for this one, guys. United Airlines 787. I didn't know who the hell to fly with, guys. I honestly think United 787 looks the nicest to me right now in this livery. I absolutely love the United livery in the 787. So without further ado, my friends, here we are. Let's have some fun. First things first, I'm just going to go up here. We're going to go to edit weight, fuel, and imbalance. Before we go into the airplane, before we do anything else, um, let's go ahead and head over to Simbrief here. Okay, Simbrief, we need... 13,000. I'm going to put you down. We need 13,000 fuel. So I think we're just going to put 6,500 in left and right tanks. 60. Sure, we'll put 6613. That's fine. Um, all right, cool. Very good there. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Center of gravity. We can leave that. That's fine there as well. All right, we're looking for a zero fuel weight of 165.2 with a tow weight of 177.8. Well, there's 177.8. Pretty much as close, I think, as we're going to get it. We got Noel5233 coming in with a $5 donation. Thank you so, so much, Noel. He goes, 787, shut up and take my money. Noel! <laughs> thank you so so much my friend for the support very very much appreciated my friend absolutely awesome dude thank you so so much yes sir the 787 all right so we got 177 we're just going to call that 170 what are we going to call that guys we're going to call that 170 170 178,000 kilos okay that's fine let's go to done we're going to go to apply changes you'll see the aircraft kind of bobble there all right sweet so here we go guys inside the Magnite 787, oh baby, and uh, first thing is first that you're going to notice, the big thing is the electronic flight bag down there, we're going to get to that in a second, first things first guys, let's go ahead and get our battery switch turned on, beautiful, I am running a sound pack, I just want to keep everybody, uh, I am running a sound pack with uh, this airplane, so does the sound pack found on the blog spot website that we use a lot of our other free sound packs for so what is there uh it should be fun i hope it's not too loud for you guys um so first things first here guys we're gonna go down here we're gonna go to our little e-bag we're gonna turn him on i'm just gonna make sure that everything is set here instant on our irs align that's all fine perfect go to main menu we're gonna leave him where it is right now um first thing is first let's go and get some lights up in here shall we I like those on just a little bit. Uh, we're going to use our dome light. It goes all the way off. Overhead panel light can go on. And then we're going to go down here and we're going to get aisle floor panel light on as well. Everything has a nice little yellowish hue to it. it looks great. Um, all right, sweet. So uh, what we need to do here, guys, let's go ahead and get our adheres set to the nav position. Wonderful. I'm going to go down here. We're going to go to ground services and we're going to select GPU. Uh, GPU is on and available. So we're going to go ahead and grab that. Let's get our seat and cabin utilities turned on. Uh, let's go up top. So now everything works in this airplane, guys. Uh, window heat can all be turned on. Uh, our anti ice can all get set to the auto position here. Um, all of these lights, everything works now. AC buses, all of that works. Um, our hydraulics, all of this works. Everything pretty much works now, guys. Everything is everything is pushable. You can get our equipment, cooling fan, research fans on, left pack. We got our trim airs. Everything pretty much works now. Everything is pushable. Everything is ready to go. Um, so that is all good. Ready to go there. Um, let's spend some more time down here on the FMC, guys. Or sorry, our little e-bag. So we're going to go to main menu here, and I'm going to show you guys what to do. Terminal charts. So we are sitting on the ground. Uh, MKJP, so we're going to go MKJP, and let's grab that, there we go, Norman Manley International, and we're heading to MDPC for Punta Cana International Airport, perfect, we'll throw that in there, looks good, perfect, and then we can go back to main menu, and then we can go over to our performance page, wonderful, so we're going to leave that blank for now, guys, let's go down to the FMC here, uh, actually, you know what, let's go to plugins, squawk box, connect, uh, we are United, UAL, 2088, 
We'll get that. UAL. Perfect. United Airlines. We'll connect. Wonderful. Let me go to Squawk Box. Preferences. OK. Plugins. Squawk Box. Send flight plan. All right. So we are going from MKJP over to MDPC. Punta Cana. Uh, our alternate airport will be TJSJ. TJSJ, which is where we will be going on Thursday. Oh, baby. Uh, it's slating us for 37,000 feet. I think that should be fine. We're going to have a tailwind as well, so it should be good. Flight time is showing an hour and 15 minutes. We're supposed to do it gate to gate in an hour and 40. That shouldn't be an issue here. Uh, we've got our flight plan plugged in. Everything else looks good. We're going to have fuel for two hours and 40 minutes, as it said there. Perfect. All of that is good. Let's go ahead and send that off. Wonderful. Uh, we're going to pop him down here as well. We still got Lincoln online. Thank you, Lincoln, for coming and uh, chilling with us, staying with us, man. Uh, we'll go ahead and flip over to frequencies, and we'll flick back to frequency. There we go. And he should be able to get us now, which it is there. Perfect. We're just going to get our X open up there as well. All right. Sweet. Um... Kingston Radar, good afternoon once again. United 2088 Heavy IFR to Punta Cana, please. United 2088 Kingston Radar, clear to Punta Cana via the NX6 departure, climate making 6,000 squawk, 67934. I declared into Punta Cana, the NX6 departure, climb maintain 6,600 in the box, United 2088 Heavy. United 2088 Heavy, your back is correct. Push to start your discussion. Call for taxi. Commit 1014. Ready, push starts on us. We'll let you know I'm ready to taxi. Thanks so much. Uh, United 2088 Heavy. All right, so we got that in there. 6734. We got that plugged in into the box. Let's go ahead and select 6,000 feet here off departure. Wonderful. All right, cool. So all that is ready to go. Let's go down to the FMC here, guys. We might as well get this rocking and rolling. So MKJP. MKJP. That is where we are. We'll throw that in there. And we are going to MDPC. MDPC. Beautiful. Punta Cana. Uh, our flight number. We are United. UAL. 2088 heavy. Perfect. We'll throw that in there. Execute that. Wonderful. Let's go to departures. Over here, we are planning the runway 12 with the Enica 6 departure. And we are taking yeah, the Bennett transition. So we'll go ahead and execute that. Perfect. Go over to flight plan. Next page from Bennett, we are going direct to Pitex. P I T E X. There we go. Perfect. Pitex is going in here. We'll execute that. Uh, we got Tucker R coming in with a ten dollar donation. Thanks so much, Tucker, for the support. He goes, "Why is my jar design three thirty not working? It says frames too low, and one of the screens stays back." Tucker, do you own the Flight Factor A three twenty? If you do, go to your plugins folder. Right click on CEF in your plugins folder. Copy that. Make a uh, copy of that to your desktop. Then delete the CEF folder. Every time that you want to fly... Yeah, there you go. Frame rate Nick is actually explaining exactly what to do, Tucker. He can help you out. He actually helped me out in describing this. So, huge shout out to Facebook, Nick. That will make it work. Um, hopefully, he can help you out there, though, dude. Thanks very much, man, for that 10 dollar donation very very much appreciated my friend all right guys we're going to take pytex to barrel and then we're going to go execute that and then we're going to do our arrivals we are planning the arnav runway nine via the barry two bravo uh oops i i fucked up my bad uh all right barry okay barry two bravo arrival where are you? Barry 2 Bravo, Arnav Runway 9. Let me look at my charts here for a second. MDPC. And we're going to do approach. We're going to do Arnav Runway 9. And we're going to take it via uh, DASVO. DASVO is what we're going to take it via. We're going to go to flight plan. We're going to execute that. Let's go to our legs page here. Make sure we don't have any crazy discounts, which it doesn't look like we do. Uh, everything looks good there. I'm happy with all of that. Wonderful. Looking good to go here, guys. So that is good. MKJP. Wonderful. All right, sweet. 
So now that that is all done there in our flight plan, let's spend some time on our e-bag here, and I will show you guys how this works. I'm just going to throw on Unicom here for a second, guys, so we can kind of uh, hear in case you guys has any uh, any uh, issues with that. So as you can see, once you put in your uh, main menu, once you do your terminal chart, so MKJP to MDPC, you just hit main menu, and then your performance page will be unlocked, and it will give you your arrival airport. So we are planning runway 1-2 for departure. Conditions are dry. Uh, winds are, we can update our winds here in MKJP, MKJP, winds are 130 at 07, so we'll do that, 130 at 07, and this is where I really, I mean, guys, you have to look at this as a big picture, okay, look at what they have done here, and just imagine this system depth throughout the entire airplane, it will come, I promise, all right, it will come, it's just being eventually, but um, it's so, so cool. It's so amazing that they have this going on, as well as this right here. I can't seem to change the flight number. I don't know where to change the flight number. But if you actually see when we tune to frequency, 125.4, it actually shows that we're on frequency. It shows our squawk code. We're obviously, that's not our cell cal. We're obviously united. We can change all that stuff. I was flying yesterday as Air Canada testing out this plane. But yeah, like just little stuff like this, the whole customization here of, of this I mean, we got to give it to them, guys. I know it's a slow process, but everything is a slow process. They are a very, very small team. Um, so, I mean, I I'm looking forward to what they can do with it. That That is for sure. I really think it's, you know, I really think they're on with something here. Let's just hope that uh, they can stick with it, right? All right, guys, we're going to be doing a D-rated takeoff today. Uh, that should be fine. Uh, we're going to be doing a flaps 15 departure. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. that looks fine. Our takeoff weight, I wrote it down, was 17,800. That's what we're going to put in there. 178,000, perfect. And our CG, we're just going to put as three. That's fine. Uh, we're going to be flexing today. We're going to put, uh, let's put in 45C. That should be good. And uh, we're going to turn our AI to off. And we'll calculate center of gravity off limits. Center of gravity, sorry. I meant to put 35. There we go. Now we can hide our keyboard, and there we go, guys. All of our interesting stuff has been... Obviously, we're not going to pay attention to the N1 percentage. I think it needs a little bit of work, but that's probably because of my CG. Uh, I'm just putting in there what works. Or the... Uh, cell temp that could be what it is but it gives us our v speeds we got a v1 of 140 vr of 140 and a v2 of 150 with our stab trim set at 1.5 beautiful so now that we have all that if we scroll down here we actually see that our v speeds have been plugged in here beautiful so it's like directly connected through this guy here we can go to our main menu and go to aircraft setup and then i can change this type of stuff here uh we are we can change that we are united ual Beautiful. So you'll see that that'll change that right here. United. And then we can actually probably, uh, I think we can actually add our flight number in here. United 2088. Yeah, you can. So there we go. So United 2088. So you guys never forget. We can actually get the tail number if you guys would like. It's November 36962. So November, uh, ba -ba -ba, November, oops, got to delete that. November 369, what was it? 69 bills in there. 36962. 36962. All right, there we go. So now we got the tail number as well. You'll see that all in here. Tail number, November 36962. We've got our squawk code. We got our cell cal, United 2088. All that cool information. I don't know how to change the flight, uh, flight information. If anybody knows how to do that, that would be much appreciated. Uh, I can't seem to do that. We're going to go UAL. UAL. Perfect. All right, cool. Sweet. And we'll save that in here. Uh, iCal code, that obviously can be deleted. Um, all right, cool. Does anybody know how to change the flight number? I don't know if anybody does know how to do that. Um, you just got a new computer, so it should be good. Nice. Um, I don't think anybody does know how to do it. All right, fine. That's fine, guys. No worries. Um, so let's go ahead up top here, guys. We're going to get our fuel pumps left side, fuel pumps right side. We're going to get the center balance on here as well. Um... And then we can go ahead and fire up our APU here, guys. So APU is on the up and up. Beautiful. We can go down here. We can select our page to fuel, which we're going to leave here. We've got 4.3 and 4.6 thousand pounds. Uh, was this airplane updated? Yes, it got a big update. 
So obviously 150 plus 15 is going to be 165. You guys should know that. We have been cleared up to 6,000. We got our squat code in here, so we can actually flip that over there. We go. Perfect. Looking good. And that's pretty much it, guys. APU is on and available. Let's get our APU gens on. We'll go down here. We'll go to save. And we'll go to menu. And we'll go to ground services. GPU disconnect. Perfect. Uh, external power is off. Everything else looks good. We've got APU gen on. Batteries on. IRS are aligned. We have our window heat. We'll get our backup heat on here as well. Fuel pumps are on. Everything else is ready to go, guys. Let's get our beacon light to the on position. We'll go to plugins. Better pushback. Let's go to start pushback. Show me where you want to go. I would like you to right there. We'll go ahead and enter that in. Is this the 787? The yes, so it is, is the 787, my friend. It is, it is. Alrighty, so that all looks good here, guys. We're just going to wait for him to connect, and then we'll go ahead and get our push on. Pop Cornelius, how are you, dude? Welcome, welcome. Um, is this the aircraft money and worth your opinion? <sighs> That's a toughie. It's a toughie right now. Uh, I'm not quite sure, to be honest with you. Oh, look who's back. Our friend. Nice. I'll let the, uh, I'll let the team do their, do their part here. Okay, all doors and hatches are closed. Ready to connect. Perfect. Thank you, guys. Much appreciated. All right, panel lights are all on. Everything looks good there, guys. We can go ahead and get our logo light on as well. You mind as well. That is all good. All right, he is connecting to us. Wonderful. We can just hit our park brake here quickly. Get that jetway to go bye-bye. Look sexy, Cap. Oh, yes. Look at that, man. I can't wait. Can't wait to look at that beautiful wing flex once again. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, that wing flex. You know it's going to be gnarly. Abraham, yeah, we're dealing with him, man. We are dealing Still with him, dude. No worries at all. Inserted. Release park and break. All right, park and break is released, my man. Start in push box, and you may start engine. Seatbelts over to the on position. We got everything else ready to rock and roll. You guys ready? I'm ready. Let's go ahead and fire up engine number two. Love that scenery, Payware. Yes, Ian, it is Payware. It is, it is. Punta Cana, here we come, my friends. Surreal United flight? I don't think so, the pilot Dylan. No, I do not believe so. Fastest engine start? <laughs> it's not, it's still going. It's still firing up. Takes a little bit for it to get stable. Alrighty, good start on engine number two. Let's go ahead and start number one. It's really not his day today. We're five people on him. That's it, Dot Wallop. He's, I got, he's an idiot for even trying, to be honest with you. I mean, it's good, though. You're getting all his accounts, right? So, yeah, hey. Why not, man? Uh, still uh, is the 787 model capable of dual engine start? Yes, it is, Tim. It is, it is. Operation complete. Set park and brake. Park brake is set. Disconnecting tool. Stand by. Alright, so we're going to select LNAV. And we're going to select vertical speed here, guys. Going to be climbing. Uh, initially, we'll put uh, about 3,000 feet per minute. Put about 2,800 feet per minute initially. All 
All right, disconnect him. All right, guys, let's go ahead and select flaps position 15 for departure. And of course, we need to get our trim value set here. We got Swole 217 coming in with a $5 donation. Thank you so, so much, Swole, for the support, dude. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Absolutely wonderful. has been removed. Hunt signal on the left. We'll see you next time. Have a safe flight. My man, Swole, thank you so, so much, dude, for supporting the stream. How do you keep sounds working? Which ones are you using off the blog? I'm using the 787 sounds uh, off the blog. And you can keep it running as long as you don't open up any of the menus. She will stay running. Look at that, guys. Ready to go. We got our flap set, trim value set as well. Auto break over to Max RTO. Beautiful. Let's give him a call. And Kingston Radar United 2088 heavies. Ready to taxi runway 1 2. Uh, two zero eight eight follow the uh, Delta eight three twenty via Alpha holding point runway one two. Alrighty, we follow the Delta eight three twenty holding point runway one two United twenty eighty eight heavy. Oh, Cathay Pacific seven four. Yeah, you did. Listen to these sounds, guys, on this bad boy as well. If you guys can't hear it well enough, just let me know. I'll turn the sounds up for you. There is the Delta A320 right there that we will be following. Kingston uh, Center, good afternoon, sir. Uh, Spirit 157 with you, flight level 330. Well, I mean, if I turn it up, Vess, everything has to go up. Spirit wings. Uh, this guy's just five, sitting on the seven, runway. Kingston <laughs> radar, we set transponder squawk 6712. Squawk 6712 for Spirit uh, 157. Uh, Booby, I can't really turn them up. I mean, I can only turn everything else up. I'll turn everything else up when we get ready for departure here. If you turn up your private parts, go up too. Jesus Christ, that's... <laughs> You're insane, man. It's too bad our American friend Cameron couldn't join us for this leg. All right, let's make sure our packs are set to the on position here as well, guys. Beautiful. Looking good. We are good, good, good. We're just going to get our APU to the off position. APU gens can go off as well. Doors auto, auto break on RTO. That is exactly what we want to see. Ian Reed coming in with the $5 donation. Thank you so, so much, man. He goes, I need those glorious sounds. Where do I cop? Uh, mods, can you guys link him to the blog spot sounds, please? That would be very, very much appreciated. Uh, Ian, just keep in mind, dude, if you are using them, you cannot open up any menu other than, like, these menus here. You can't open up any menus if you're using them. Um, all right, just keep that in mind. You can turn up volumes using a different app in the Windows setting? E. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, okay. Perfect, so I descend to uh, flight level 320 and uh, direct uh, for Matos, sorry, just direct Matos uh, 157, thank you. Look at this thing, man. Woohoo! Look at the wing flex, it's so beautiful. Can you please turn up the volume? Just wait, man, when we get to departure, it will be up. 7-8 is looking sharp. Hell yes, it is, my friend. Hell yes, it is. That's weird. Why did he get... He barely made that runway. Holy. Iberia, where are you going? Iberia. Why is he flying Iberia? Oh, baby, what is up, Cap Cam? Beautiful 787 there, my dude. Sam, how are you, man? Welcome aboard, dude. Thank you much, my friend. Glad you're enjoying it, dude. Where's Mr. Smitty? Is Smitty even around, or did he just uh, do a quick drop in? He's working today. I think he's working today. I mean, you guys have to understand the 787. God damn it. Fucking idiot. The 787 is a very, 
very quiet airplane. Yeah, it's it's one of the newer one. ones, right? So Ivan Ivan just doesn't give up, man. <laughs> like this dude, you want to talk about persistence? Holy Ivan! If you ever need a job interview for anywhere, man, give them my email and and I'll tell them. This guy's work ethic and persistence is beyond anything I've ever seen. Yeah, Ivan, one, one, five, if you worked three, as hard five, on five, trolling five, me five, as you five, did, say, five, some, five, building five, a scenery, five, creating five, an airplane, five, you could be one of the best developers X-Plane has five, ever, five, ever five, seen, five, man. Five, like, Ivan, put, your, put yourself five, to good five, use, five, buddy. Five, you have this much time and this much effort to just sit here and troll me. Imagine what good things you could be doing with your life. Just imagine, man. Imagine what you could do with your life, dude. The possibilities are endless. God damn, dude. I don't understand. That was Ivan? Yes, that was Ivan. Speedy just did a drive-by to toss the cash and dip out. <laughs> Speedy just like 100 bucks. Peace. <laughs> oh, Smitty. <laughs> Fucking okay, right. so we have a heavy line up away, runway one two. That's what I'm saying, Ed. Like, like, this guy actually okay, spent like half the time trying to fix it, it makes the sounds disappear instructions on the website and only work for ten minutes. Oh yeah, I saw that, Bill. See that that's where I think it gets a little bit sketchy, Bill. The fact that like we have to change the file names and stuff, like I don't know, man. That's where I think, like, it becomes kind of illegal <laughs> with what we're doing. I mean, listen, I don't even know, like, okay, well, obviously this is legal what we're doing because Jared Design provides this, but I think, I don't know, it, what, what gets me is I'm just not sure, you know, um, how, how legal it is, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Is terrain a thing? No, terrain's not a thing yet. Okay, damn. Well, listen, those engines cap. Remember to turn that volume up. Yeah, I'll turn it up all the way. Nice, my friends. Hope the good streams, loving these streams. Jeffrey, thanks so much, man. Thanks for the kind words, too. Glad you're enjoying these streams, man. Does the HUD work? No, I do not believe so. The HUD does not work. Go to the plugins. Plugins? Is stream my full top job? Yes. Uh, go to plugins and press terrain. I don't see anything here. Terrain radar, but we have to. Oh shit, it does work! Show terrain. It does work! Hell yeah, it does! Sweet. That's sick, thank you. Nice. Can I turn the brightness up? Oh yeah! So much better, thank you! Brightness. One A320 style? No. We want 737 style. Yeah, we do. Good shit. Thank you, whoever pointed that out. You are the man. How much was my PC total? Uh, I don't know, man. It depends. It's, it's been over the years. It's not like I built it all at once, right? Would you recommend buying this plane? I mean, listen, dude. I, I'm still as 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 I was before on the plane. As long as you're not expecting an amazing simulation from day one yes this plane is very nice to have especially with the aviator edition with the add-on of this and they're constantly being worked on and updated it can only get better guys i mean
this is this is what we have as our base right now it can only get better from here that's my logic on it it can really only get better uh, why don't you get an i9 I mean I just got the 8700k there's really no point there's not much difference between the 8700 and the uh, and the 9900 what are the requirements of being ATC on VATS? I'm not quite sure, Vinch. Uh, Cap, can we go full throttle on takeoff? We're going to go close. Full throttle will put it through, uh, it'll put it into the red N1. We're looking for about 98% on our N1 percentage. So it'll be close. It'll be loud. Any Mad Dog flights coming up? Yep, absolutely. Approaching. Oh, there is. Trust me, you need the 9900K. Well, maybe, Booby. Is it, a, is it LGA 1151, though? Because I'm not fucking buying another motherboard just to do a, just to do a processor. There's not a chance in hell. If I can get the i9 in here, we may think about it, but yeah. Kept getting excited for the stream. Perfect way to end the night. Afflicted Sim. Thanks so much, man. Much appreciated, my friend. Thanks for those kind words. Plan on buying a new PC, and I guess how much I can... Uh, be with your specs. Guess how much it can be with your specs. Right now, probably expensive. Uh, i9 works with a Z370. I think I have, I don't even know what I have. I'll have to check. I think I have a 370 board. It is a whole new motherboard for the i9. That's why I stood with the 87. Yeah, like I'm not, I just did the upgrade. Like there's no way. Kingston Radar United 2088 in sequence. United 2088, line up and rate runway 12. Line up and rate runway 12, United 2088. Approaching. Okay, release our park break. Landing lights going on. Strobe lights going on. Wing lights on. Taxi lights off. Lit up like a Christmas tree. Ready to go, my friends. Professor Kidman, uh, how are you, man? Three, uh, three, two, one, zero, three, contact. Contacting, flight level 220. Coming to for Talk about FPS, too. This plane is just so damn friendly on FPS, guys. It's, it's on a different planet. Alrighty. Approaching. What is the FPS right now? We're getting almost 70. 65, 66, 67. We're almost in the 70s. Yeah, it's a zero eight eight heavy plane, the Emica six departure, runway one two, winds one three zero at seven nine. Emica six departure cleared for takeoff runway one two United. Twenty eighty eight heavy. Alrighty, my friends, let me turn this volume up all the way for you guys. Okay, let's hear it, guys. Throttle's up to 40%. Beautiful. And takeoff power is set. Hey, Kingston Radar, good afternoon. Once again, uh, United 320. 96% on our N1. Airspeed is alive. United 320, heavy. 80 knots, cross-check. Please put squawk code one more time, your uh, radio cut out. V1, rotate. 
Okay, uh, the, uh, clear of you, the Anakin 6 departure, climbing 6,000, and squawking 6716 for United 3 Kenny Heavy. United 3 Kenny Heavy, we're back at the correct report, we're ready for Approaching. the extra report, we're ready to attack the British by your own discretion. If we should start pilot discretion, and we will report ready for taxi, United 320 Heavy Taxi. Alrighty, perfect, and vertical speed is climbing, looking good. What a beautiful departure here, guys. Alrighty guys, let's go flaps up position five. Our speed selected here of about 250. Alright guys, flaps going clean through 200 knots. It's got 310 plugged in here. Perfect. Or 370, not 31. My apologies. Fuck, I could have just flipped this. It made my life so much easier. 37. Alright, wonderful. Flaps are clean. Everything's looking good here, guys. Let's uh, bring that climb rate down here a little bit. Uh, do not use VNAV if I were you. I would still fly this plane until they get their systems fully figured out. I would still initially climb off of uh, a vertical heading here. Cap 787 a mod. Uh, well, this is the um, Magnite 787. All right, guys, let's bring those engines back down slightly here to about 95 percent on our N1 for climb. That is good. Climb at about 2,400 feet per minute should be fine. Nose lights coming off. Logo lights off, wing lights off, runway turnoffs are off as well. Perfect. American 1159er Kingston radar. You are clear go on the three arrival of zero one in your position zero eight. Defense the minimum public altitude. Damn, that's beautiful. Uh, joining the, the freeway aircraft. No, forty dollars. Forty dollar aircraft, my friend. Okay, clear for the go around. Look at that wing flex. Oh, baby. And, uh, go establish on the arc and, uh, Why don't you get an RTX? Uh, no need for that. Does this plane have a cabin? Hey, no. That beard is thick. Where's American Aviator? He couldn't fly this leg, unfortunately. He could not fly this leg. How about we just do that? We'll make it easier. If I get the CF file on the Flight Factor 8320, will I get better frames? Uh, no, you have to have that in, uh, Kevin. It has to be in there. Otherwise, that airplane won't work for it. All right, let's do our climb out here. We're looking for about 290 knots. So we'll decrease our nose here. We'll climb at about 2,000 feet per minute. Gain some speed up through 10,000 feet. Landing lights left side, landing lights right side. There we go, guys. Beautiful. Cap, is this better than the Magnite? This is the Magnite. Uh, is this plane worse on FPS now? Nope, I would say it's just about the same. If not better, man, even maybe a little bit. Ooh, that ortho with those clouds. Not too pretty. What's more stealthy than a stealth bomber? True. Remy, coming in with a two year old donation. Thanks so much, Remy, for the support. Very, very much appreciated, man. Glad you're enjoying the content. Thank you so, so much for supporting the stream. It was Hello Cap from an Air France pilot. Remy! What's going on, dude? Air France, man. That's very, very cool. What are you flying, man? What kind of... What kind of... What kind of bird do you operate in there, Captain? Uh, is this X Viro recommend and it is laggy? I mean, it's not laggy for me. I have plenty of VRAM, though. 
to deal with the lagginess, so to speak. Look at that, man, with the fucking... The view all distorted from the heat blur. Wow. It's so good, man. Oh, hello. Cabin tour. <laughs> that is so cool looking. Love it. Goodbye and have a great flight content. I like Professor Kidman. Thanks so much, man. Now's a good time to say it, guys. If you have not done so already, please make sure you smash down that like button, guys. Let's get this video up to as many likes as we can before the end of the stream. That would be very, very much appreciated, guys. Songs are required. You got it, Daniel. Seven eighty-seven. Yes, sir. 787, my man. I managed to finally get the ortho tile fixed. I'm working for the new EDDM. Uh, Victor guided me. Man, Victor is a fucking saint and a savior. He's so amazing, man. There's so many times... He's helped me out when I've been so stuck. So yes, absolutely awesome. Uh, Boobeep could have helped you as well. Boobeep's right. Boobeep is a mastermind as well when it comes to stuff like that. Have you ever had to do a go round? Yes, we have. Damn it, Cap, you did it again. I bought this plane. <laughs> Ride dog. Hey man, it's worth it, Ride dog. Get yourself the sound pack, buddy. Oh baby, is she nice, man. Nice tone for the cockpit sound. You got it, man. I think it looks good. I figured the train thing because I was having problems, but it's a great thing. Yeah, no kidding, Eli. It's very, very cool, man. I love it. I love it, my friend. We got Remy coming in with another two euro donation. Says, I am a Boeing 777 pilot. I love your streams. That is absolutely awesome. Remy, thanks so much, dude, for tuning in. Very, very cool, man. Love meeting real world pilots thanks so much for the support man huge no floaties to you dude very very much appreciated remy that's awesome man we're gonna be flying the triple seven on thursday actually we're gonna fly it from uh we're gonna be doing short hops in it but uh we're gonna be going to san juan and to saint martin oh boy cayman airways has a bay water livery way better livery than caribbean uh airlines you should check it out uh juice d'orange we flew cayman airways when we flew into the cayman islands last week that is why we flew air jamaica today but yes i am aware they do have a beautiful beautiful livery thanks so much man very very much appreciated bye-bye jamaica just leaving the tip here oh boy 77 one of the best aircrafts i've had the pleasure of flying on thanks scoot bangkok to perth 2018 very cool man very, very cool. Alpha the holding point one one two. We got Four, phenomenal gaming nine, coming in with a dollar sixty six donation. Thank you so so much, phenomenal gaming. Very very much appreciated, my friend. Glad you're enjoying the content, dude. Thank you so so much for supporting the stream, man. Absolutely wonderful. Goes check out Aviation JFK on Instagram. Great stream cap. Love the content. Phenomenal gaming. Thanks so much for those kind words, dude. Very, very much appreciated, man. Glad you're enjoying the content, and uh, thanks so much, dude. I'll definitely check that out. Strength B, no worries at all, man. Welcome aboard, dude. Hope you are doing well. Welcome, welcome. Got to climb at about 1,800 feet per minute here. Coming up through 23,000 feet. American 
Do I have a job? You're looking at it, man. You are looking at it, my friend. Full-time content creator on the good old YouTube. How did you get the 787? Alex, it is right here, man. Let me get the link for you. United one five three my airspace to the north. That is exactly which one we are flying, right there. Alex, I posted it for you. What is the oil pressure and temp about? I wouldn't worry about it, man. It's just because we're coming up through a cruise. Holy moly, man. I gotta turn that music down. There's too much sounds going on in my head right now. Uh, I want to climb at about Mach 7.2. That's what we're looking for. Oops. Brandon Best! with a two dollar and eighty cent donation thank you so so much brandon he goes just because i can freaking ivan <laughs> thanks so much brandon for the support dude very very much appreciated sir huge no floaties to you man thanks so much for supporting the stream brandon very very much appreciated my friend what's your thoughts on the cockpit i mean it's not bad it's not good it's it's got a huge update since the first version this is what i'm really excited to see once we move away from this um you know, X-Plane 10, X-Plane 11, um, native FMC. Once we start moving away from that, I think we're looking good. I really like what they've done here with the primary flight display. I think that is awesome. The, um, the texturing, the 4K, I think it's beautiful. It looks amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. So I like what they've done there. Uh, obviously, I'd like to see this changed as well into more of the actual 787 style. This is again once more of the um, more of the um, this is stock X-plane stuff, so to speak, and then uh, of course the e-bag over here, which gives us all of our performance, and you can add charts into it, and aircraft setup, and you can do all kinds of cool things. So that's really cool. I think it's really really cool. JEJB, what's going on, man? What do I never see, dude? Just an Av meme? Uh-oh, I don't know what I missed. Uh, Dimed Bat 2, come to the $2 donation. Thanks so much, man. I love your streams. Keep up the good work. Thank you so, so much, Dimed Bat. Very, very much appreciated, man. Huge no floaties to you, dude. Very, very much appreciated, man. Um, Kaz. Hey, United 320 Heavy. Hold I mean... FSX and P3D has been around for, what, 20 years now? It's inevitable, dude. I mean, it's pretty much... It, to me, it's an invalid argument. Like, I mean, it, it's irrelevant, dude. I mean, if X-Plane had been around for 10 years, we would have the same planes. You just gotta give it time, dude. You gotta give it time, man. Is that for United 2088, sir? Uh, negative. Yeah, it's Bye. 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 will zoom up the max, something both the Sims haven't got. It's very true. Very, very true, my friend. I mean, I think X-Plane has a better 320, to be honest with you. I think the Flight Factor 8 320 is better than FS Labs or Aerosoft or anything like that. My opinion, of course. Man, this thing climbs like a pig once we get up here to these altitudes. I like both P3 and X-Plane. Hey, man, like, that's what I mean. Like, listen, if it wasn't so expensive to run P3D and have to buy the license every time they updated and the airplanes and, and all that stuff, I would run probably both, dude. Like, honestly, 
The fact that it is, the simulation is such an expensive hobby as is already, that it, it's hard to own both. It really is. And just wait, once that MD-11 comes out, oh boy, people are going to be drooling that they had X-Plane. Just you wait. Wait for that MD-11 to come out. Oh man, am I excited for that. Thin Air does that. No climb. You got it, Ed. You got it, man. The real 787 climbs like a bat out of hell. I mean, the performance isn't too bad off this guy. I mean, we could always bring our engines forward a little bit more here. Let's go for 97% uh, on our N1. You just wish all the sims had the same plug-in? Yeah, unfortunately not, but... Don't mention the uh, MD-11. I know I'm excited, man. I am excited, my friend. Dog on 75 climbs like a homesick angel. True. Very true, Carl. Again, Lindsay. How long has P3D and FSX been available, man? You do realize P3D is, is FSX, right? So nothing has changed in 15 years. I would assume that they probably would have better airplanes, man. Yes, it makes complete sense. I, I, I don't deny it. I don't deny it at all. What I'm saying is let X-Plane get to that point. Skylounge stream last night advised that all X-11 freeware will be payware one day. Sounds like a P3D enthusiast right there, if I've ever heard one. You see an outside view? Yes, it's loud. We gotta turn it down. Hey Cap, here's a joke. Microsoft, think about it. <laughs> yep. Like, how could Microsoft just kill off the flight sim, man? Like, it's so fucked. Like, if you think about it, like, it's crazy. Yeah, it's a zero. Uh, I bet. Okay, uh, three, two, zero. That website for wow. Germany scenery you linked has excellent site for free scenery. Absolutely, Carl. Absolutely, man. MSC, how are you, dude? Welcome, welcome. Uh, now you need to check the controller list. Uh, Holy hell, Cap, you're popular. Nice. Yep, I see it. <laughs> I'm glad, though. Like, I'm, I'm, I, I mean, it sucks, Dot Wallop, that it's taken this long to bring this much awareness to it. And, like, I just, Dot Wallop, like, I hope you know, like, today means nothing to him, right? Like, you know he's going to be back on Thursday, and then he'll be back on Saturday, and then he'll be back on Sunday. Like, you know that he's not leaving, right? Dot Wallop, like, this is what he does. Like, he's not going to stop. As long as you guys understand that, you'll, you'll know, like, he, he won't stop. He's not going to stop. Yes, got to set standard. Once I left out, there was no executive support uh, for continuing flight sim. Oh, yeah, yeah, they were gone. Jar 330 and the only 330 out of getting better. Yes. Maurice, how are you, man? Welcome aboard, dude. Boop, beep, take care, my friend. Thanks for coming to hang out, dude. Thanks for uh, all your mod help as well, dude. Over Unicom, thanks for wonderful ATC link, and we'll catch you soon, man. For 2088. Uh, no problem, too. All right, one, two, two point eight. We're over to Unicom. Okay, now we can turn sounds down and we can go outside. Okay, now we can catch some sweet views. Okay, um, there's cruise altitude. Wonderful. I would like to cruise at Mach point eight two. So we're gonna let that build up here, guys. Just give me a sec. We're gonna let our um, you know, our speed build up here. For some reason, I'm not getting wins. I don't know why. A little odd. Approaching. I thought this thing could cruise at like Mach 0.85 as well. That's Bomber. Thanks so much, man, for the support. Very, very much appreciable. <laughs> Jesus. 
Very much appreciated, my friend. I was reading a comment and tried to say two words at once. It didn't work out too well. <laughs> Thanks so much, dude, for the support. Very, very much appreciated, man. A330 stream. Uh, maybe soon, Bluffy. Maybe soon, dude. I don't have auto throttle. No, I don't have it armed yet. And I will show you why. Once you arm auto throttle, watch what happens to our N1. That's no bueno. That's how you get engine fire. <laughs> That's how you get engine fire. So, you manually control it, put it up to about 97%, and then once you've reached your speed that you would like to cruise at, then you can engage auto throttle. Uh, we got HX Trinity coming in with a dollar thirty-one donation. Thank you so, so much. He goes, what is the sound pack they're using for the Mag Knight 787? Can somebody please link him to the sound pack that we're using? That would be very, very much appreciated, man. 787 with CRJ systems. I mean, they're getting there. That's what I mean. We got to support them, guys. Like, it's, doesn't, it's not just going to happen overnight, you know? Freeware, I have two legs, but I don't like uh, to run like Carl Lewis. Nice. Do you have threat optimization on or auto? It is on. Can you please uh, upgrade your 777 to the extended and fly the 777-300ER? Bauer, I'll have to email them because I'm not quite sure if I'll be even able to do that, dude. So I'll have to email them, if I'm being honest with you. Alright, there we go. Auto throttle is on and armed. Good. Once I get my new PC, I'm going to fly X-Men 11. Nice. Thanks for the BSS sound pack and the download for the A320 sounds amazing. Cheers. No worries, String B. No worries at all, man. Catch some outside views. We can jam our music. There we go, guys. Perfect. Oops, didn't mean to do that. There you go, guys. Look at that. We're back over land already. Holy. Is this Haiti? Are we already over Haiti? I think we are. Yeah, guys, there's no cabin for this plane yet. No cabin. How many likes are we sitting at, guys? If you haven't liked the stream already, please do so now. Get this video up to as many likes as we can. I'd like to see 400 by the end of the stream. That would be very, very much appreciated, my friends. We got Mike Desert coming in with the five euro donation. Thanks so much, Mike, for the support. Take app, love the content. Been a fan since the first stream. Keep it coming. Greetings from Eham. Oh, baby, Mike. Thanks so much, dude, for the support. Huge no floaties to you, man. Very, very much appreciated, sir. Glad you're enjoying the content. And thank you for those kind words, man. Absolutely awesome, my friend. Did you preview X and Viral 1.10? Uh, I did see it. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what to think anymore, dude. <laughs> I don't know what to think with these weather programs in X-Plane anymore. It seems to me like they're all just turning into the same thing. And what I'm learning, slowly but surely, is that it, it's pretty much on X-Plane. It's pretty much on Laminar to make it just more acceptable. Because right now, we're so limited to what we're allowed. I mean, that, that's pretty much what I'm gathering. How's the flight model for this plane? It's nice. It feels heavy. But it also is responsive, the way you would expect a, a newer type jet to be. So I, I like it. It's not bad. It's not bad. 
Um, the only thing is I'm running the sound pack, so we don't really get any uh, GPWS callouts. So it's a lot of uh, a lot of floating or a lot of smash. <laughs> One of those two. Can you show your explain realistic settings? My turbulence effects are not bouncy enough. Uh, yep. We have it set to G-Force effect 25%, ground effect is on, uh, heading anticipation 15%, natural head bob is 100%, pitch anticipation 35%, roll 35%, um, taxi anticipation 35 touchdown that's all there, turbulence. Uh, movement 50% and volume 50%. I'm actually going to put the volume to 35%. I'm actually going to move my movement up to 60%. And I actually need to update it because I don't have the clear air turbulence and all that other stuff uh, modeled in with it. We fly to Puerto Rico next. Yes, sir. That's going to be on Thursday. Puerto Rico and St. Martin, my friend, on Thursday. Should be a lot of fun. Smoking the e-leaf there. Yes, sir, we are. Uh, we got Bartos coming in with a two-pound donation. Thanks so much, Bartos. He goes, great stream and a 787. You got it, my man. Thank you so, so much, Bartos, for the support. Huge no floaties to you, man. Thank you so, so much, dude. We're going to fly the MD-11 as soon as it's released. Without question. Without question, Pilot 192. Without question, my friend. Any idea when Flight Factor 777 V2 is coming out? Uh, not for a while. Not for a while, my friend. Emma's here. Welcome, Emma. Hope you are doing well. When is the flight to Cancun? Not quite sure, man. Not quite sure, to be honest with you. Le Gamer, the sound pack's literally been given out like... 10 or 15 times now. Mods, can you please link that one more time? Is there anything X.11 uh, that you're going to get or you don't have already? Some new scenery that just got released by Just Sim. Um, bu 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 what was it? LMML Malta. We'll be hitting up Malta um, soon. Who released Lisbon XP? Really? Man, this guy's just going ham. Is anybody buying this? Like, does anybody buy those XP, like, city sceneries and stuff? This guy, this Tabaret. Tabaret guy, he's gone ham. He's literally, like, released, like, 30 of those city sceneries. Malta, yeah. Gotta pick up Malta. That's on my short list. Definitely want to fly in there next time we're in Europe. Our Lisbon will include the city. That's right. Emma's Lisbon will include that. So no need to get that. Uh, Cap, I love you a bit more for Flying United. Oh, man. Thanks so much, dude. I love, man. I love the... Uh, I love the 787. The United delivery on the 7-8, man. It's beautiful. Is this PMDG? <laughs> Cat Strader. Okay. Holy shit. The man himself. What's going on, buddy? I haven't seen you on this side of it. <laughs> I love Kat's comments, dude. He always comes up with the best comments. <laughs> Is this PMDG? <laughs> How are you, Kat? Welcome aboard, man. Hope you're doing well, dude. I was uh, I was watching your video this morning. You were flying the uh, 78 on PE. How are you, buddy? Welcome, welcome, man. I thought this Mr. X was free. Uh, Mr. X used to release freeware stuff. He has uh, since moved to payware. For obvious reasons, I think uh, if there's anybody that doesn't need to explain why he went from free to to payware, it's it's uh, Mr. X because uh, the quality of his airports are simply he sets the bar in my opinion. Uh, doing well, buddy. Good to see you. You as well, Cat. Hope you you're doing well, man. I know you like to spend some time over on the YouTube side of things. It's nice over here, Cat. It's you know it's quiet. <laughs> there aren't 20 other streamers also streaming Flight Sim here on YouTube. It's me and a handful of people having fun over here. 
We added a command for the sound pack. Ah, Ivan. No way, dude. You're still trying? For shame, Ivan. Are you guys ready? Let's let's see the countdown until he gets banned again. There it is. <laughs> Fucking Ivan, man. What a guy, dude. What a guy. <laughs> Out of control, man. Gotta explain days ago and I want to download the Zebo mod for 737, but when I... The link you made on one of your streams, I can't or I don't download the Zebo. Can you please help? Uh, can somebody please post a direct link to the Zebo for my good friend who uh, is having issues with it? Dude, I'll have you know I regularly comment asking why I'm ripping you off. What? What do you mean? I'll have you know I get regular comments asking why I'm ripping you off. How? What? <laughs> really? Dude, man, you were like... I mean, if you want my honest opinion, you and Matt were the reasons that I got into streaming. I found your streams years ago. And I was like, this guy's right up my alley. He's a nice, chill fellow. Everything's awesome. That's uh, that's pretty crazy, Cat. But that, that makes no sense. If anything, I think I should... Like, I'm the impeaching off everybody here. Ivan, he's back on another account. This guy, man. He's never gonna learn. <laughs> there he goes. Banned another account. Good job. Cat's Raider is here. Yes, we are talking with him. I guess the beard. <laughs> oh, boy. Cat, are you gonna be at Flight Sim Expo this year, Cat? I know you were at last year in Vegas. Are you gonna be going to uh, the one this year in Orlando? Because we'll have to put those two beards together. Oh, boy. That could be a fun time. He goes, of course. Hell yeah, man. That's awesome. Good stuff, dude. Should be a blast. This is my first time going. I'm very excited. Built a little bit of fan base up over the past year. What a year it has been. Once again, thank you, community, for all that. Um, so yeah, man, it's going to be awesome. I'm looking forward to it. Might even make it out to the exclusive partner our mutual friend is setting up. Might even make it to the exclusive partner our mutual friend is setting up. Oh, boy. I didn't know he was set. I, haven't, I actually haven't spoken to him in a, in a couple of weeks, man. So, uh, yeah, that'll be interesting. Good guy, dude. <laughs> Ivan, man. Banned. <laughs> this guy, dude. This is like ultimate tryhard status, this guy, man. That'd be awesome. Uh, Kat, do you plan on... Um, do you plan on streaming this year from the event? That was one thing that I, I always, always found it amazing. Was that you somehow... Like, did you bring your PC down, Kat? Is that how you were doing it? Like, would you bring your own PC down and then live stream off your PC? And is the internet even good enough for that? Like, that's crazy, man. I remember watching you one year do that. I was like, this guy's nuts. Holy moly. You're streaming. There's like 50 people standing all around you. Just come over to the Cosford this year. Cat Strader and Cap Canada. Cosford. Well, that's, that's a tough one. I'll be doing streaming from the Pilot Edge booth. Two years ago, I took my entire setup at the event in Hartford. Yes, that's the one. That's the one, Cat. That's the one I remember watching and being like, damn, dude, like, this guy is going all out right now. <laughs> That's so awesome, man. Last year I streamed from TFDI's booth. Very, very cool, man. Very cool. That's awesome, dude. I love it. I thought about, like, doing something like that, but, I mean, the travel alone for me, dude, I mean, it's, you know, upwards of 2,500 miles from where I am. So, um, it's going to be a long trip. I'm looking forward to it. Let me tell you, um... I think it's great that I'll be able to finally meet so many faces, so many people. It's the biggest pain in the ass never again. I can only imagine, my friend. That's why I was like, holy moly, dude. I can't even I think, think like, I can't even think about that, man. The AV tube, how are you, man? Thanks so much for the subscription. Very much appreciated, sir. Glad you're enjoying the content, dude. Welcome aboard, man. Welcome, welcome. All Ivan cares about is uh, himself and no one else, apparently. I mean, he's as stupid of a troller as it can get. I mean, whatever. <laughs> to, to each their own, man. To each their own. Uh, does it have a cabin? No, it does not have a cabin. Not right yet. Uh, how much time do we have to spend uh, on the moose to get the nearest train station? <laughs> right? Take, takes a minute. Takes a minute. <laughs> Gotta ride my moose. I love the Canadian stereotypes, man. They're the best. I love them. Gonna come and meet you in Orlando. It's must be can't wait. Lucas, gonna be awesome, dude. I'm excited, man. I'm very excited. I feel like this is gonna be a long three months that we are waiting for this. I feel like it's gonna be a minute.
think you missed my question. Can I ask it again? Absolutely, Vinch. Absolutely, man. Is that a 1,000? No, this is the 900 variant. That music is a little bit loud. Let me turn that down. There we go. This is the 900 variant, my friend. Uh, Cupcat needs to ride his mouse from Manitoba. All right, let's count the time again. Like, I swear he's just... <laughs> Good job, Ivan. What a guy, dude. Oh, man. We're missing all that beautiful ortho down there. All right, hold on. Let's get a better view here. There we go. People are flying over from Norway just for the expo. That'd be awesome, Dot Wallop. That'd be really cool, man. Very, very cool. Hey, Cap, can I get my drink? My seat is 10A. Approaching. I mean, we'll have to do our best. I don't know where our flight attendants are today. Balamoop! Thanks so much for that subscription, man. Very much appreciated, sir. Glad you're enjoying the content. Welcome, welcome. Faded Red, of course, man. Wait, who is a member? Whatever happened to Ginger? Oh, man. Ginger's, um... She makes her appearance every now and then, but Ginger, uh, Ginger likes the, uh, the beach over in St. Martin. We left her there about a year ago, and she's been MIA ever since. Toros, you suggested her free rate since I saw no ads and paid explain. Of course, yes, absolutely, Vinge. All the, uh, all the tutorials on YouTube and stuff like that will be free, man. Don't have to pay at all. It's weird because our... Are you guys... Why is our ETE not going down? You guys seeing that as well? Our ETE has been stuck at like 43 minutes. Not not leaving it either. It's been weird. What monitor slash monitors do I have? Uh, I run... Uh, Um, I run my monitors on a little bit of a different setup. I use a 43 inch wide. Yes, you heard that correctly. I have a 43 inch wide 120 hertz LED TV that I use for my main simming monitor. I have a 32 inch curved uh, 120 hertz LED monitor as my second monitor. And then recently uh, I bought another uh, 30 inch curved over here as well that I haven't used yet. It's just been sitting here. So I don't know if I want to do the triple setup. So far, I just have the other monitor using uh, setup for my PS4. So yeah. Um, ba -ba -da -ba -ba. A plus plane, no issues, zero bugs. Highly recommend. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I love how Cat's just like so truthful about it. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Let's see, SSSS, science and math, how well you do. Got to go by Spec Life. Thanks for tuning in, man. Much appreciated, my friend. And that ortho down there is just beautiful. Wow. Looks great. We're going to get the 787 sound pack. Here you go, Ride Dog. We already made a... Uh, I think we made uh, a thing for it. Yes, they made a quick command. They make TVs 120 hertz native? Uh, absolutely they do, Bearded Yeti. I don't know if they do any more. Uh, my main monitor here is uh, for my TV here. Shit, dude, this thing is old. I bought this a while ago. A while ago. Uh, Cody, let me do my best. Says, Cap, do you think they have a key on the keyboard set up for different emojis? I don't think so. That would be cool if they did that, because then we could just spam it. <laughs> we got Jordan Todd coming in with a $10 donation. Jordan, thank you so, so much, dude, for the support. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Absolutely awesome. Thank you so, so much. Says, good morning, you handsome young man. Good to see you. Love the 787. Today's a national holiday, so what better way to spend it than watching you? Jordan, thanks so much, dude, for the support. Very, very much appreciated, man. Huge snow floaties and damn it, Smitty in chat for you as well, man. Thank you so, so much for supporting the stream, dude. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. What is different in the Aviators Edition? Well, uh, we got a bunch of retexturing. 
So our PFD here has been all retextured. Uh, more importantly, we kind of have this e-bag here with performance. It actually gives you your V speeds and, and all that fun stuff. And uh, there's uh, you can add charts into it here if you want to add documents, directories. You can add your charts in here. Um, yeah, pretty much. And then obviously there's all kinds of other stuff going on that we don't really know about, obviously. So, yeah. Yeah, it's weird. I've never seen the ETE um, stop working like that. I'm wondering if... Uh, here, let me try and set this up. Let's take this guy off and we'll take... Uh, yeah, now 25 minutes. Okay, there we go. So let's go MKJP. Uh, I guess I got to put caps. Thanks, Captain. MKJP over to MDPC. It's weird that it... Uh, it usually works and now it's not working. Well, at least we got our distance. Now it's not giving us an ETE. But uh, we got our distance. That's really weird that the ETE is not working. Never had any issues with that. You could probably spam emojis with a stream deck. True. True. I haven't... Uh, do you have a stream deck, Cat? I haven't really thought about getting a stream deck. What I'd, what I'd like to get is I'd like to get a uh, an audio thing more than anything. Um, like, a, uh, not an equalizer, but something where I can manipulate the volumes without going in to my settings and stuff like that. Tatted 809 coming in with a $2 donation. Thank you so, so much, Tatted, for the support. Dude, very, very much appreciated, my friend. Glad you're enjoying the content. Thank you so, so much. I literally just set one up today. Uh, I won't use it for streaming, though. Got you. All right, cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't know if I'm sold on it. I think it's, like, a little bit more expensive, really, for, I mean, listen, dude, OBS, like, who doesn't have a two-monitor setup nowadays? I mean, if we're being realistic about it. Um, you know, OBS lets you, you know, we can cut to B-Right backs, we can, we can cut to our outro, I mean, it, there, there's so many things that OBS allows you to do that, you know, just makes life easier. Where's Dot Wallop? He's still here, Dot Wallop. He's not going away, man, I told you, he's not going away. He probably likes this, man. Send me a message if you want some audio help. I've been around the block with it. Sounds good, Cat. Much appreciated, man. Thanks so much, dude. I have a $10 USB keypad that I used to change scenes and whatnot. Works great. That's what I'm saying. That's exactly it. Like, I want one of those, uh, I want one of those little, um, like those little, it's like a little numpad, right? Like your little numpad thing. I just want it, like, right here. Have we been... F yeah, we have been. Okay, so we've been flying over the... Um, we've been flying over Haiti this entire time. Do you use a joystick? Yes, Rice, I do use a joystick. Absolutely, man. I do, I do. This dude was hacking? Uh, yeah, it's, it's Ivan. If you don't know who Ivan is, welcome to the stream. You will shortly know who Ivan is. Uh, stream Deck? Yeah, Stream Deck is okay, but... I think it's just expensive for nothing. You can pick up one of those, like, Logitech makes, like, this just, like, a little numpad. The little thing, you know? Just pick one of those up. Like Kat said, you can program it, cut all your scenes, and do stuff like that. The Isle of Hispanolia. Camp Canada, what one do you use, if you don't mind me asking? What one do I use? Reese, uh, I use the T16000M from Thrustmaster. Here you go, Thrustmaster. Product placement at its finest. Uh, I use the T16000M. Um, nothing crazy. I think it retails for $129 for the set, the throttle, and the, the yoke. So, I mean, uh, yeah. All right, we need to look at some things here. We are coming up to Pytex. We need to be at 1 at 2,000 or below. Hold on, let's open up our charts here. Let's not look silly. Let me get these charts over here for you guys. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba, MDPC. We are going to get our charts open. We are uh, star, 
runway 9 Arnav arrivals. All right, here we go. Let me switch this open for you guys. You guys can take a look at this here as well. There we go, guys. All right, charts, open up here. Look at that, beautiful. All right, sweet. So we are going to be coming in from... We're planning the Arnav runway 09. Uh, I believe that we are going to be coming in from... Uh, I don't see any of these, so I think we're coming in from this side? Dab so? Uh, give me a sec here. Let me roll it black to explain. So we got barrel, dab so. Alright, so I do see dab so. Alright, so we'll open this guy up here again. So there we go, guys. So we do see dab so. So we're going to be tracking it via dab so. So we need to be at Davso for 3,000 feet, and then Davso, we're going in for the RNAV. That is runway 9 facing this way, right here. So it's going to be uh, Davso, barrel to Davso, and then Davso, the RNAV, into runway 09. So it should be nice and easy. Not too bad. Davso, not... Oh, Dasvo. Yeah, you're right. My bad. There we go, guys. Do my best to try and incorporate my charts here. A lot of you guys have been... Yelling, I don't show enough charts. My apologies. I will show you charts. Let's explain how a global so you can see wherever, like, prepared. Uh, yes, it does. Dub, so you say? <laughs> oh, boy. All right, there we go. Barrel is here. Um, so that is looking good. I see barrel. We need to be... Honestly, if we need to be at 3,000 for dab, so we need to be at, like, 8,000 for barrel. Between 8 and 7, I would say, is good. So I'm going to put in uh, 8,000 here. 5,000... Mm, shit, I don't even know. No, I'd say we need to be at like 7,000. 7,000 or less. Um, still 120 miles out from barrel. No need to start our descent now. Oh, there we go. ETE has been updated. Okay, 22 minutes. Good. Awesome. Um, is that charts or cleavage? <laughs> A little bit of both. A <laughs> little bit of both. <laughs> um... The key to live streaming success, right? Exactly. Charts and cleavage. Chase Fellbaum, how you doing, man? Doing well, sir. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. How well do you think an uh, Core i9 9900K and a GTX or RTX 2070 with 32 gigs will run X-Plane? You will be pleased, my friend. You'll be running it pretty much what I'm running it. Maybe even a little bit better because of that i9. Um, I have a 1080 Ti, so obviously we've got 11 gigs of VRAM. Can we just take a second and look at that beautiful photo reel down there? Holy, man. It's another huge thing about X-Plane that you won't see in P3D is that photo reel. The ease, just how easy it is. I understand you have Globac, Global, whatever, by uh, Orbex and stuff. I don't know, man. Still nothing. I don't think it beats the beauties of ortho for XP. No cleavage, legs. <laughs> hey Cap, how's the updated 787? I'm enjoying it so far, man. I'm enjoying it so far. No complaints from me, dude. Photo real looking sexy? Oh yes. I don't know what we're flying over right now. Is this Porto Prince? I don't know what this is. We, I think we're like right on the border of uh, Haiti and the DR right now. I'm not quite sure though. Yes, that's right, Cap. You had a... Jesus. This guy, man. He's just, like... He doesn't stop, dude. He doesn't stop. <laughs> oh, my God. Get the 777 for longer range, however. True. True. We're going to get the... Um, we're going to fly the 777 on Thursday, actually. This guy, man. Any vape trips, Cap? Nope. I don't know any vape trips. A bluffy, unfortunately, man. Probably a good thing, to be honest with you. The least you vape, the better. Skullman, just put it in uh, media posts or something like that, dude. Alrighty, guys. 100 miles out from barrel. I would say we should probably start our descent at about 70 or 80 miles.
Just wondering, Cap, did you talk to the President of Vats about Troubles? Yes. That is exactly why we have a little bit of the support that we have today. I, uh, yeah, fired off some emails yesterday on my day off. All right, let's get our sounds turned back up here, guys, because we're inside the pit. All right, we're about 93 miles out. I'm going to start our descent here, guys. We are going to descend, uh, let's say, let's go with, uh, let's say about 1,600 feet per minute here as we get close. Should be good. Alright, I see a lot of, uh, I don't know what I'm seeing in front of me, so I'm just going to flip this to plan real quick. Let's step, step, barrel, dab, so. Lee ban, runway 9, alright, we should be good. All right. Any word on Nightcap Ken? I hope he's doing well. Nope, Grim. I don't know where he is, dude. Not answering my questions. Not answering my phone calls. I haven't even seen him online in the better part of about two weeks now, man. So, I mean, one could only assume. I, I hope he got out of that. God forsaken relationship that he was stuck in. I mean, listen, man, Knight's not a bad guy at all. It's uh, it's the ball and chain attached to Knight that I think is the issue here. That's the big underlying issue. Butter Captain, I will do my best, start. I'll do my best. We've got one butter today. How many FPS are we getting right now? We're getting 75. 75. Uh, we got Oliver McVinny Wells. Thanks, dude, for the two, two euro donation. Very, very much appreciated. Evening from Espana, Cap. Navigraph sub worth it? Absolutely, my friend. 100%. Especially if you plan on taking your simming career a little bit to the next level. Following charts and that type of stuff. Going on Pilot Edge. Flying on Vat Sim. Uh, yes, definitely, definitely um, a must-have, man. Absolutely. Uh, Lucas, my bad, dude. Let me go ahead and check that out. Lucas says, have you seen Norwegian fly into Montreal with their 737s? Do you know why they do a Guadalupe to Montreal? Makes no sense. Company from Europe to fly a 737 in Canada. Does it please explain? Lucas, they're trying to hit the market, man. Money is money, dude. If uh, if there's a if there's a need for those flights, there's a need, man. People will be all over that. I mean, you'll have to ask them. I personally don't know why Norwegian would choose those routes. But uh, you never know, man. You never know, Lucas. My apologies, dude, Lucas, as well. If you think I'm trying to ignore the comments, it's not the case at all, my friend. Uh, do a shared cockpit flight with Flight Deck to Sim. We'll have to see one day, man. Maybe one day, dude. FPS lives matter. Brandon Lucero coming with a $2 donation. Thanks so much, Brandon, for the support, dude. Very, very much appreciated. He says, get you some Canadian greenery. My man. Thank you so, so much, Brandon, for the support. Huge no floaties to you, dude. Very very much appreciated, my friend. Thank you so, so much. This plane is going to be legit as fuck when it's finished. I agree, right, dog? It's exactly what I'm saying. Let's have faith. Let's let's understand. Like, I'm, you know, not going to get myself too excited about it, but I have faith in them. I, I really do like what they've, what they've done, and I think that it's going to be, um, I think that in the long run, it's going to be worth it. It's, it's going to be awesome. Just join uh, time. What if I missed my man Joseph? How are you, dude? Welcome, welcome. First thing in the jar 350, 155. Very nice, dude. Very, very nice. If we don't get an FPS counter, we're going to make an emoji protest. Jesus Christ. You guys and your FPS, man. Is it smooth? Yeah? All right. Sit back and enjoy, my friends. That's probably my favorite feature right now. Is that, that weird look. So good. From the haze of the engine. Ugh. Oh, it's so good. We got some Russian accents. Hello, friend. Welcome. We fly Punta Cana. With our friend Ivan. Hello, Ivan. <laughs> oh, Ivan. Ivan, Ivan, Ivan. When will you learn, my friend? 
I hope he gets bored of it, because, like, I mean, I'm even bored of it now. Like, Ivan, you're, you're, you're just a boring troll now, man. You can't do much when they're watching you, eh? Can't do much, Ivan. It's a different 787, right? You have a different one than before? This is the Aviator Edition. So, yes, there's been a lot of things added to this one that have not been added before. Kev Kale will name his first child Ivan. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Okay. Um, transition level is 18,000 feet here in the Dominican. We're going to go MDPC. We're going to get our most current meta results. Uh, winds are 1108. Few clouds at 2,500. 27 degrees. QH 1014. Wow. Somebody take me to the Dominican, please. I could go for 27 degrees with a low of 21 tonight. Oh, boy. Framerate Nick uses an FPS counter just on a simple walk. <laughs> Jesus, man. It's really funny how people on this chat mention the A380 and get timed out by Nightbot. Yeah, because we added that, dude. Like, enough is enough, man. <clears throat> it's the same people coming in stream after stream. Hey, Cap. Can you fly an A380? Hey Cap, can you fly the A380? Hey Cap, do they have an A380? Hey Cap, does x 11 have an A380? Hey Cap, can you fly an A380? No, hey Cap, the question is, can you fly an A380? Every stream, man, it doesn't stop. So it's got to the point now where you say A380 in chat, you go to the timeout loan. You have penalty box. Penalty box, you go. Uh, Remy, coming in with another two euros. Thanks so much, Remy. Very, very much appreciated, man. It says, bye, Captain. Going to Paris in a Boeing 777. My man, thank you so, so much, Remy, for the support, dude. Huge no floaties to you, man. Safe and happy skies, Remy. Thank you very much, dude, for the support, man. You can see how it's annoying? Yeah, just a tad. Just a tad. I should interview Ivan on stream? Oh, Jesus. Oh, boy. Yeah, you guys say it, guys. Here you go. Enjoy your penalty box minutes. Alright, 40 miles out. We need to get that descend going here. Let's go to about 2,000 feet per minute. Going to bring that speed down to about 300 knots here as well. Cap says A380 repeatedly. Nightbot times him out. You're probably going to get timed out, Bearded Yeti. Thank you so much, dude, for the $2 donation. Huge no floaties to you, man. Very, very much appreciated, sir. Going to go when's the next stream? Joseph, Thursday, 2 p.m., my friend. Andrew Cunnison, how are you, man? Welcome aboard. And three more people say it, right? Like, you guys are dumb, man. <laughs> you guys are just asking for it right now. Uh, Kepke flying EasyJet soon. Nice. Very cool, man. FPS counter, we send bagged milk. Oh, Jesus. What about A380? <laughs> I mean, that'll probably work, Cat Strader. Shh, don't tell them that that'll work, though. <laughs> oh, man. You know, <laughs> you know it's bad when you have to ban an airplane. Like, we can't... Like, this is what happens... This is what happens when I give you guys nice things. <laughs> we just can't even use them. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> so many people getting timed out, man. Oh, dear lord. You guys are... <laughs> Alright, mods, start handing out the bigger ones. Hey, man, I won't even give uh, my folks a Boeing 787. <laughs> nice, cat. <laughs> nice. I hope we butter this one out and we don't float half the runway. Something tells me we probably will. You have low, low oil pressure. Check the engine page. Yeah, it's... It, I mean, it's not low. If you actually look and see it, it's sitting where it should be. Um, I don't even think we can get to the engine page. No, we can't. We just get to fuel. And flight controls. Hydraulics and electrics. Uh, I wouldn't worry about it, dude. It, it's always in the... It's always in the... Uh, always in the yellow. If it ain't red, it ain't a problem. You got it. All 
Alright guys, through 20,000 feet, we got 10 miles to go. We need to step on that descent rate, boy. We need to get our speed down here as well. Time for some spoilers. Time for some... 2,600 feet per minute. We should hit it there. Cobalt is here. What's going on, Matt? Welcome back, man. Hope all is well. Thanks for tuning in, dude. You deserve a damn timeout or a hammer if you knowingly type the A380. Yes, I agree. Timothy, thanks so much for the subscription, dude. Very, very much appreciate it, man. Can I get some Patriots loves? Ring number six. Uh-oh. Right Dog's going to start a fire in here. People are going to start fighting. All right, there's 18,000 feet, guys. Let's get our barrow plugged in here. 1014. There we go. 1014 is plugged in. Patriots won the Super Bowl. Oh, I know, Lucas. I know, sir. I follow my sports. I'm a pretty big sports guy sometimes. Depends. I wanted sweet, sweet victory for the halftime show, right? <laughs> Kep, why do we get a I and I error occurred when I load the 787? Please help. You get an I and I. I think you need to probably have the latest Java downloaded. Pat's made me 200 bucks. Nice, eh? Sweet, dude. A new Boeing. It is the 787. It's not so much new. By the way, guys, we're flying into a scenery. I'm going to link the scenery right now. Um, I had the payware scenery available for uh, X-Plane. But I really have to uh, link this scenery here. Because in my opinion, this is ten times better. Like, this actually beats the payware that is available right now. And this is what we're going to be flying into. Here you go, guys. There is the link right there, my friends. Kept getting do I mean battery discharge shows on my mag night doesn't show anything bad to happen. Nope. It's just until you get the engines turned on. Just until you get the engines up, run and go. We got Alberto coming in with the $5 donation. Thank you so, so much, Alberto, for the support. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Huge no floaties to you, Alberto. He goes, uh, e tres ochenta. Haha, <laughs> that's Spanish for happy landings. Alberto, thank you so, so much, man. Huge no floaties to you, dude. Coming in with that ten five dollar donation. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Everybody, there's that scenery as well. I will uh, post the scenery for you guys there. Absolutely beautiful. All right, guys, we really need to start descending now. Like, real bad. Like 3,000 foot per minute. Bad. <laughs> My payware put to Canada. The runways are always fuzzy. Even on max settings. Yeah, Nick. I think it's just this extremely dated, dude. It's definitely meant for X-Plane 10. Uh, it remains the rest of the flight even with the gens on. Yeah, that's weird. Huh. That is weird. I turned mine off because I was getting the message. But mine turns off. It's, it's really weird. Captain Florida coming in with the $2. Thanks so much, man. He goes, what's better, Captain 777 or the A330? Definitely the A330. For now. I don't know how long that's going to be, but for now, definitely the A330, man. All right, guys. Auto breaks over to three. Captain Florida, thanks so much, dude, for that support. Very, very much appreciated. Huge no floaties, dude. Hand fly it. We will soon, man. We're just going to get ourselves to a little bit lower altitude here. We need to be at 3,000 for Dasvo. Do I like this aircraft? I do. Yes, I do. I think they're on the right track with it. That's for sure. good. We need to get our landing lights on here. Got our logo light on as well. 
for uh, the soups that are watching, Ivan is definitely going to be sitting on the runway, so just keep that in mind. Appreciate you guys, everything that you've done today. Alrighty guys, that's going to do it for the music today as well. We're going to go sterile cockpit here at 5,000 feet. When we find the Zebo early today, you got an IAS disagree. What can I do? I would re-download the plane here, Mitchie. I've never had that issue before. Maybe re-download? Alrighty, there we go. Let's slow this bad boy down. 1,600 feet per minute here. Should be good. Actually, you know what? We can actually go down to like 1,000 feet per minute here. Start slowing that plane down nicely. The only thing, guys, as well, this plane does not have, like, your, uh, you know, your, your landing rates stuff. So, just keep in mind, uh, I have it right now at about 135 knots. Seems to be perfect for the V-approach speed. Cap Florida with another $2. Thanks so much, man. Because you have to butter this landing cap. Good luck. Cap Florida, thanks so much, dude, for the support. Very, very much appreciated. Jake Moore, how are you, man? Welcome aboard as well. Hope you are doing well. Guys, let's arm our spoilers. God damn it. There we go. Armed. Let's go flaps position five. Okay, we need to be at 2,500 feet for our next waypoint. So let's get 2,500 plugged in. We're five miles out from Davso at 3,000 now. Perfect. Looking good. I'm looking for the airport. I believe it is right over that away, which it is. Perfect. We got Dom Smith coming in with a two dollar donation. Thanks so much, man. Ivan Ivanov, where's Crocs? <laughs> Jesus. Thanks so much, Dom. Huge no floaties to you, man. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. Thanks so much for the support, dude. Absolutely wonderful, my friend. <laughs> Dom. Thanks, Dom. Uh, for Cap, what's your roommate doing? He's uh, doing dishes. Let's go to 190 on our speed here. We got Vess coming in with a $1 donation. Thanks so much, Vess, for the support. Very much appreciated. Come drop, drop top. Get active sky to get rid of mini come drop clouds. Tip of the day for Cap. Jesus Christ, Vess. Vess, are you getting paid? <laughs> are you getting paid by active sky to say these things, Vess? I'm starting to question whether or not you are, sir. <laughs> oh, Vessy boy. Thanks, Vess, for the support, man. Very, very much appreciated. All right, guys, let's get 170 plugged in here. We're going to go gear down, flaps 15. Oh, baby. United 7. Look at that ortho. Woo! 2,500 feet looking good here, guys. I should be getting... I would say so, Vess. With the amount of spamming you've done recently, I would definitely say so. All right, guys, good. We're at 2,500 feet for PC 250. Looks good. We are looking good. We got KLM Pilot coming in with a $2 donation. Thanks so much, KLM Pilot. Says, good afternoon, Cap. How are you, my friend? Welcome aboard. Huge no floaties to you, KLM Pilot. How are you, my friend? Alrighty, we're making left base. Left, uh, I guess we'll MDPC traffic turning final 09. Alrighty, guys, looks good. My airplane, my throttles. Let's hand fly this B. Nose lights on, wing lights on. Good. 
Let's go flaps 17. I'm going to get our final approach speed plugged in here. I'm going to go for about 140, 139. We'll see how that goes from here. Got donations coming in. We got Hi-Fi coming in with a dollar donation. Thanks so much, Hi-Fi. As we do, 335 uh, for mention. You mentioned it twice. Flaps 30, 148 for landing. If your math works, maybe. Maybe. We're going to go 140. Let's go flaps 18, flaps 20. Looking good on our approach. I see two white, two red, so we're looking good there. Cut those throttles here. We'll get our final approach speed plugged in. All right, guys, let's go flaps 25. And yes, everybody get your landing rates in now. You can get your landing rates in now, my friends. Let's go flaps full. for reason speaking we're on final approach to put to canna <laughs> i know you're counting on you thanks so much bearded yeti for the five dollar donation very very much appreciated my friend thank you so so much dude for supporting the stream absolutely wonderful dude very very much appreciated are my spoilers armed they are good all right cool all right guys we're getting slightly under glide slope here we're gonna pull that nose up KLM Pilot coming in with a $5 donation to butter that landing cap. Thank you so, so much, KLM Pilot, for the support. Very, very much appreciated, my friend. We will do our best, sir. We will do our best. All right, guys, landing checklist. Gear is down. Three green. Flaps are full. Spoilers are armed. Auto brake is set. Cabin crew has been advised. We've been given clearance to land. Let's do this, my friends. Just trying to get back on that Pappy system here. driven down this highway right here that we're flying over numerous times. I don't know why we're still seeing four red. I think we look damn good right now. Speed looks great, looking good. I look damn low, really? So I don't know, man. Like, it looks fine to me. I don't know, maybe I'm just crazy, dude. Maybe I'm losing. See, there we go. Okay, Pappy. So we're not too low. Pappy's good. We're three red, one white. That's usually what I like to chase and explain. I find that that is how the Pappy system should be. Remember, guys, no GPWS callouts if you're using this sound pack. I do apologize to the viewers out there that can't hear it, but uh, let's just do it all together, all right? <laughs> we can make it happen together, guys. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Forgot the flare. <laughs> Open those reversers, hold that nose through the D-cell, nose down gently. There we go. We're calling it a great landing, guys. <laughs> uh, plane, can you thank you? Yeah, D-cell, thank you so much. She doesn't even want to stop either. Oh, there we go. All right. And 70 knots, stole those reversers. Over to manual braking. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Punta Cana. Oh, baby. Yeah, the, the, it's, it's, it gets a little funky with the GPWS callouts. We also could have floated the entire runway. Um, <laughs> very possible in this plane as well. But not bad, guys. Not bad at all. We're going to take that nice and uh, nice and smooth. Planted it on. Nothing wrong with 240 feet per minute. You guys are stupid if you think there's anything wrong with that. You guys should go educate yourself in uh, planes, abilities, and flying. 
240 feet per minute on a big jet like this is nothing. This is a very, very average, everyday landing. So we're going to take it, and we're going to be happy with it, all right? Especially with X-Plane 11.30 now. Let's turn this sucker around. we got guys on short final here. So, uh, actually, I don't know if he's on short final. Uh, I don't know who that is. That's probably what's-his-face anyways. Still going to have maintenance. Check the struts. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Hardy EPU is firing up. Perfect. Looking good. We got our flaps clean. Spoilers are put away. One dirt full. It's got our runway turnoffs on. We got our taxi light on here as well. Taxi back to the terminal here, guys. Welcome to Ryanair. You guys are so fun. I'm telling you, man, I, I, I almost like sabotaged myself by giving you so many butters. Honestly, so like, I would rather get a 245 in this because... And I know Cobalt is here. Well, I think he's here. Cobalt will attest to this, and he'll let you know that um, this thing will literally float the entire runway if you allow it to. This airport is underrated. Wow, it looks so nice. That's what I'm saying, dude. It's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, we're going to close our train. We don't need that on anymore. Welcome to Death Airlines. Book your death flight. Jesus. <clears throat> what headset do you recommend for flight simulation that isn't going to put a hole in my bank account? HyperX Cloud 2s. Some of the best that I've had. Minus these Sennheisers. These are, these are on a different level, but... Yeah, if you don't want to bust the bank, I gotta go with the, San, uh, with the uh, HyperX Cloud 2s. Landing light's coming off, guys. Strobe light is coming off as well as we vacate the runway here to the left. Gonna be taxiing back to the terminal. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome. What a beautiful flight. Open your own airline and call it Flying High. Oh, baby. APU Gen is on. Beautiful looking plane. We'll be flying it more often, guys. Members of Cop K, you have permission to spam the entire the emoji song now. Yes. Yes, you do. Look at him, man. He's still trying. He's still trying. Never gonna learn, man. Never, ever gonna learn. Punta Cana. The guy's coming with a five euro donation. Thanks so much, man. He goes, I'm an official at Ryanair and I'd like to offer you a job. This is your first paycheck. I know it's bad, but what do you expect? This is Ryanair. <laughs> Jesus. Christ. The guys, thanks so much, dude, for the support, man. Very, very much appreciated, dude. Absolutely awesome. We got KLM Pilot coming with the $2 as well. This is great landing cap. Thanks so much, KLM Pilot. Huge no floaties to you, man. Very, very much appreciated, dude. Thank you so, so much. We float and butter. People yell at me for floating. We we land perfectly on the marks on it with a very average landing rate. People say I, I broke their back. There's no winning on YouTube over here, live streaming. There's no winning on Flight Sim, guys. There's no winning. Just constant losses. <laughs> Can't win. Unless you perfect the landing all the time. One more flight. Nope, that's it for the day, man. I will be back on Thursday next. Oh, and boom. There we go. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and pull the park brake, guys. Looking good. APU is on. APU Gen is on. Engine number one is coming off. Engine number two is coming off. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the entire flight crew, we'd like to welcome you to Punta Cana International Airport. Yeah, get it in, Ivan, for the two seconds that you're going to be allowed to do this. Get it in, Ivan. You're so cool, man. Oh, boy, Ivan. So cool. Looks like this in real life. Yes, it does. Indeed it does. I've been here multiple times. There you go, Ivan. Bye-bye. wonder how many accounts he's been banned from today. What a guy, dude. What a guy. Bought the Magnite 787 about 30 minutes ago and I have a glitch with the sound uh, where it is the same. I hear when I turn the engines off and it doesn't change when I go to full power. That's really weird. That's very, very weird. Very, very weird. Well, there we have it, guys. At the gate in Punta Cana. 
Oh, baby. I linked that scenery here, guys. If you guys would like this scenery, uh, I will link it once more. Here you go. It is freeware scenery available for everybody. Ivan, this is going to be three accounts, dude, in like 30 seconds. Man. My goodness me. I'm, I'm glad that they're getting off, everybody. So there we go, guys. We have made it. I have spammed the, uh, the airport there. If you guys would like to pick that up, it is freeware. Uh, it requires a couple sceneries, but all scenery libraries that you should have already. Uh, a lot of it's done using the Mr. X library. So yeah, absolutely wonderful, guys. Let's go ahead and disconnect from Squawk Box. <clears throat> Poor little Ivan's going to have to go sleepy now. Sorry, Ivan. I know today wasn't very much fun for you. Um, so we're disconnected there. Everything looks good. Wonderful. Um, I guess we can just go ahead and toggle our replay mode, shall we, guys? Let's toggle replay mode. Back the sucker up here. Let's take a look at that. Beautiful landing. Right on the marks, guys. I don't want to hear it. Looks like our nose wheel came through the ground. Interesting. Right on those marks. Alright. We'll go shift three. Uh, that's not what I want. Shift three, shift three. Okay, not working. <clears throat> the song's coming. I just gotta, like, actually get our views. Really? Really, X-Plane? God damn, man. These views. Um, all right. <clears throat> Let me go get the song going here. All right. Minus 250 is how they tell you to fly a jet on landing. You fly it into the ground. You don't float flare like a GA plane. Carl's got it. Carl's got my back. <laughs> it's it's really hard too without without the GPWS callouts, man. You kind of get lost. You're, you're kind of just going off the sound sounding. But here we go, guys. Take a look at that replay. Beautiful 787 coming in. Punta Cana. Boop. Right down. Some, some weird stuff there. <laughs> Jesus, man. All over the map with that one a little bit there, Captain. <laughs> oh, bad. Yes, we got a huge shout out to the Vatsim supervisors today. Coming in, dealing with Mr. Ivan Ivanov at his finest. Thank you guys so, so much for all the support today, guys. Very, very much appreciated. Anyways, guys, this is going to go ahead and do it for today's stream. I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed something a little bit different flying the Magnite 787 around. If you did like it, please make sure you slam down that thumbs up button guys and maybe we'll fly it again soon thank you guys so so much for tuning in everybody who donated sponsored smash that like button hit that subscribe button thank you guys so so much for everything that you do to the channel all of my mods thank you guys as well very very much for everything today you guys are the best uh you guys know the plan for thursday we're gonna go from punta canta to punta cana not punta canta punta cana to uh, San Juan, Puerto Rico, and then from San Juan over to St. Martin. It's going to be a beautiful day. We're going to be flying heavies around. Uh, I think we're going to take the 7-6 and the 777 out on Thursday, so it should be absolutely wonderful. I will leave you guys with some more replays here. Thank you guys so, so much for coming to hang out with me today. Very, very much appreciated. Huge no floaties, guys, to everybody, all you guys. Very, very much appreciated. Everybody stay safe. Happy landings. And I will catch you guys all on Thursday. Take care, guys.